11,000 people. 11,000 people saw that video on the White Staff, and that had a 97% like rating. 97%. Isn't that fascinating? A lot of people agree with the whole White Staff thing. About sharing tips, you remember, or did you forget that already? Mm -hmm. No. Okay. Why, well, why wouldn't they? I mean, no, I don't know. But, but then again, I, no one, no one, no one's grumpy. Who's who's okay. grumpy? All right, okay. go ahead. No, and no, I lost my train of thought. Now it's okay. Okay, that's good. I see that just <laughs> you and pancakes. Now we're just going to the movie theater. It's just that come down to two. No, no, John was working, and he was working late, so he couldn't go. Oh, see, I, yeah. I didn't know it. I didn't know I didn't it say you didn't involved follow. into that kind of friendship. That's nice. Sweet. Hey, listen, you got to do what you got to do, right? Yeah. Hey, hey, I feel you there. I'm, I'm with you. Are you guys getting? No, nah, he's married. He's pussy's better than penis. I mean, he might slot him in on the weekend <laughs> for a couple of minutes, but I don't think he's going to leave his wife over. Cold That's minutes. crazy talk. That's it. <laughs> Uh, All right. If you, so, if you leave your leave your wife for pancakes, there's something wrong with you. <laughs> I want to talk about Look, some things, man. Okay. I want to talk about some things, like for real, for real, like on the real tip. Like no jokes aside, just real talk. Do you guys want to do this or do you want to talk shit talk? No, I'm ready to go. Real talk? Yeah. What is wrong with people? <laughs> There's a lot of things uh, wrong with people. There is. I think, where do uh, we start? No, it's easy. I'm waiting. So. It's really, it's really e easy. Our arrogance went up and our intelligence went down. That's it. Okay. Well, that was a good conversation. See you next there time. There we go. We fixed it. Okay, so <laughs> see you next week. What's the next subject? <laughs> Uh, what's, the, <laughs> what's the next? It's kind of true. We we became more and more arrogant, but our intelligence is slowly going down. Okay, so that's but, but because little, of that arrogance, let me be a little bit more clear. Then let me be a little bit more clear. What happened to people being friends? Because that does not apply to what you just said. What happened okay. to people that's being friends? Thing. Being careful not careful but helping out someone on the street being there for when you need them you know what happened to that i think initially it stayed the same no not selfishness self-preservation i think people did it and got burned x amount of time and then you uh, more people get in a situation like that and then they fall off because you've tried x amount of times you got burned x amount of times and then you basically give up which is okay. We've been yeah, doing this stream for normal. a year between all of us, a year, maybe even longer than a year. We've been doing it a while, wow. right? And we all kind of know each other and we don't go anywhere. Now, are, 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 are we best friends? Are we, or maybe for some of us, you know, but we don't go anywhere. Why do people go places when they hear things of how other people's feel, uh, other people feel? Does that make sense? Like no, I'm not. I'm not. Okay, so so we're, we we all go out to, all right. We all go out to the movies, right? Okay. Uh, we're we're friends in real life, or, um, yeah, we're friends in real life. We all go out to the movie. I want. I love the movie. I love it. Right now, Jorn, mm -hmm. you hate it. Spade, you hate it. Matthew, you love it. So me and you, Matthew, <clears throat> we love it. So I say, okay, I know what Matthew loves. He likes the type of movies I love. So we're just, I'm just going to take me and Matthew now because Matthew likes what I like. In a mm -hmm. typical world, both Jorn and Spade in this scenario would be angry that I don't invite yeah. them anymore because you'd be upset. Yeah. I don't bring you because we don't have that thing in common. But uh, obvious reasons, I don't bring you because you don't like the movies I mm -hmm. like. So um, it has nothing to do with me not liking you, but people take that personally. Why? That's just well, an because it's, that's just an example there. That's an right. example. But okay, <sighs> so it's 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 the idea that you know you're friends because you have a certain thing that you guys both that you all agree with, right? 
And now that you realize that there's some things that you don't agree with, you know, you start to let me not hang out with this person because I don't like the way he does X, Y, and Z. So you're just slowly wearing away from that person because you don't agree with what they're doing or saying. So because they don't have a a common, uh, right. Right. Their, 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 com- their common things are very little now because before you're like, oh, let's all go like using the movie reference. Let's all go to the movies. So you all like going to the root movies. But because you like comedies and the other guy likes uh, action movies and you hate action movies or, or yeah, whatever but then the case why is, would you take that personally and then not associate with me anymore well, because I'm going with Matthew all the time to the movie theater? Because people are not thinking and not having the conversation like, hey, why didn't you invite me to this? And the other person is not explaining why they do it. All they do is they ghost people. So you're saying it's a lack of communication. Yes, a lack of communication. But that wouldn't be ghosting somebody, would it? We're talking about one thing that you don't have in common with a group of friends. One thing. There are other things you have in common. So why would that? So you'd rather go to see a movie that you really hate? But you're still hanging out with your okay. friends, right? That's the idea. Right. Okay, we you have different friends because I'm, cool. I'm not going to go see a movie. I'm not going to go watch The Notebook because you're a big fan of Ryan Gosling. Oh, shit. Did I nail that? Um, <laughs> yes. Oh, <my> was- <laughs> you're good. You're good. You're good. Wow. wow, bro. <laughs> Um, I haven't seen him in anything ever, uh, but I'm not going to go see that. Let me flip the role. So now me and Matthew don't like it. And if I see you, Spade, go to with Jorn to go watch The Notebook, <coughs> I'm not going to be offended. I might get a little, I don't know if offended is the right word. I might get a little annoyed or irritated that you didn't ask me. Um, right. And that's the thing. Know, and that, hey, and that are, builds are you up. going? Right, but I, I think it would get to a point where now you're going to see The Notebook and, and Fifty Shades of Grey and all these chick flicks. Don't even bother mm-hmm. calling me anymore, right? Like, I, I'm, we're cool and all, but we ain't that cool, right. you know? I don't, I don't right. want to go watch those types of movies with you. But that's what happens, Jay. After a while, you're like, oh, let's but just go But that's everybody, this though. Person. But that's, the, yes. that's what I'm saying is all people are that way. All people are that way. Is that it's true? Envy, it's envy or jealousy. No, or... I was gonna use I was gonna use this panel as a reference point because we've had over the year and a half, maybe we've done this panel. We've had a lot of different opinions about all kinds of things that we discussed. That's because and we're even though we had varied opinions. Yeah, but most of the population is adults. It's a matter of a break in <laughs> no, 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 it's no, a no, matter no. of a it's we're a real of... adults. We're, it's we a can have a, a conversation. Point. There has to be something with, I mean, even Howard Stern, right? There has to be something at some point that breaks somebody where they, where they, the straw that broke the camel's back. Hmm. In any a, a, a discussion? You mean a discussion point? Or you mean. It could be something. a discussion point or a, I fuck your wife. You know, it, it doesn't matter. The <laughs> point is. <laughs> Is that um, so I know I, I'm being serious that it, it wouldn't matter. It would just be something. And I really what this comes down to is me trying to find personal look. And that, let's just cut. Let's cut through all the bullshit instead of me trying to beat around the bush and then go through it and find the two birds and the rock to kill the two birds with while I'm living in a glass house. Let's just cut through that. OK, so at the end of the day, at the end of the day it is what it is. You know, uh, at it, the same time, let's cut to it. it if, if you look, and I know we've discussed this before, but I want to put this more on a public platform because I don't think we've ever discussed this in a public platform. I, I know we have slightly. Anyway, I digress. If I, I over the years I have built, I don't want to call it an empire, but I've I was a guy that would go to a place and people would run up to me and take a picture. Now you think in your head your best interest is to become that person because they idolize you. Okay? You would think. Now, this is going to be hard for you guys to relate to this because you're not in these shoes, so you can't really relate. But just hear me out. I'm going to give you a perception of somebody who had... 
a somewhat of a celebrity status. I found that finding friends in this field are near to impossible because it's not that they have an agenda because they have nothing to gain. They just want to become your friend because they idolized you prior to being your friend. Almost like you watching an actor or in a movie. You're like, wow, I really love him. So you want to watch all his movies. People want to watch my reviews. When they met me, everything was great. But when I got to know them, they knew all about me. And then that essentially humanized me. But people at the same time, they say they want to be close to somebody. I want to be close. I want to hear your part. I want, I want this. I want to be friends with you. But when you give them that, they abandon you. That's what I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out what that is. And if the argument is commonality or something that you don't share in common. I think we, we are fucked up. Uh, not we. I, I think people are are messed up. And, and, and I've asked people to be more active. I've, I've taken the approach of attacking more. I've taken the approach of kicking people. And everything that I've done is not. And I'm at a point now where I'm just ruling things out of my life. I've lost my bracelet. I've lost 12 pounds. You know, I, and, and now I'm just going to lose discord. I'm just, I am going to, I am trying to not disconnect myself from people but dis disconnect myself from negativity. It's kind of hard to not disconnect yourself from people if people keep disconnecting from you. Yeah, then I have nobody to disconnect from. <laughs> right, because then, then I'm just okay. disconnected. <laughs> then I'm just... <laughs> I'm just going to disconnect, but I'm only talking to myself. I, I just, I find it fascinating that you can't have friendships with people. You can, it's just everybody does not want to hear the truth. They don't. Nobody does. Nobody. Nobody wants to hear it. Nothing. Nothing. Mm -hmm. I, nobody I, wants, no, really. nobody wants to hear the problem. truth because it'll hurt their feelings. That's if why. you cheated on your they wife, don't... Spade, would you tell her? Yeah, I know the answer to that question. If it took you that long to answer, so nope. uh, well, that's a no. It's it's hard. It's listen. It's hard for me to think of that because I never thought of doing that. So it's would like you one want of those her situations. To tell you if she cheated on you. Think about that before you answer it. Of course. Of course you do. Of course you do. <clears throat> you do. You do. Because if you don't know. Yeah. This Are question you sure has been asked that? before. And I... Would, wouldn't you rather her not tell you and her just never do it again? But then you're, you're building your relationship on a lie, right? No, your relationship it's is already built. No, your house is already built. But you're, right. But that's you're just putting a new shingle on. That's all that is. <laughs> that, that house is already... It's, it's, but but don't you want it, it that that's a lie if the person doesn't tell you anything it's an omission of truth mm -hmm. right sometimes ignorance is bliss <sighs> yeah but we've talked about this before is that you telling that person is that to make you feel better or that person feel of better? of course it's to get rid of your guilt and your shame you're not doing it because you're like wow you know if i was in her shoes you just want to let it all out or you hide it because mm -hmm. you're a coward. I mean, either which way you go, you're you're the bad guy. Um, and you now passed on your insecurities on the person you cheated on. Because now that person is going to think, but what did I do wrong? All right, no offense. Right. Cheat on I'm not sticking up for the cheater at this point. But I'm going to But he had a out. reason or she had a reason. Yeah, I'm coming out of the woodwork here. I think if someone cheats, they're fine. Because that tells me that the other person is not doing their job. I know that that's fucked up, but I don't feel like it's the person that did the cheating. If you were fucking, I see what you're if saying. you were making the cleaning the dishes, I wouldn't have fucked the maid because she cleans mm -hmm. the dishes and she sucks my dick. Well, and then she cleans my dick after she sucks it. I feel like <laughs> no, everything is I mean, clean. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't know. Like, I know that that sounds so foul, but if you were doing everything on your part, the, either of you would not be cheating. Yes? Right. 
Correct. And if I come Correct. to you already and I say, hey, we're not having sex, let's fix this, and nothing happens, what do you expect me to do? I'm either exactly. going to divorce you or I'm going to fuck somebody else. Like, that is the options. Yeah. Well, we ain't going to divorce. Well, that's it then. Thank you. I'll see. You. I'll be back in about an hour and a half. Going to run to the bar, get a couple shots, and get a rim job. Get a rim job. <laughs> I'm just I'm I'm saying I look <laughs> I, I I don't I don't know I, I and people are like yeah you should never cheat on anybody uh, what if it was done to you well if you were doing everything you were supposed to they wouldn't be cheating on you See, but you it nailed it though, to, then it comes down to people not investing as much effort in the relationship anymore wanting to better than or or listen to the other person and and do everything. Because that's all, all also going out of the window, right? It's getting less and less. It's more of a throwaway society. Hook up uh, situationships instead of relationships. Everything can be related back to laziness. <laughs> Just. <laughs> I don't know about that. Yes, it is. If you're both not putting in the effort, what watch, would you call watch that? Us. This is going to sound again shallow, but we're real here. If you're, you're both attractive people, well, just watch us. You're both attractive people. You're both attracted to each other. You both got six packs. I don't know. Whatever you like. Thick, whatever. You're both attracted to one another. You are the way that you are when you met each other. Do you think you're going to have sex problems? It's a simple no. question. It's a, no. I mean, it's a, oh. it's a simple question. Oh, it's question. too fast? <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, the answer is no. You're not. Why? Because you're physically right. attracted to that person. Now, when do right. you start to get tired of that sex? If they don't care about themselves or you don't care about yourself anymore, something gets caught slipping. Right? It never right. gets old because why would it get old? If they're still attractive to you and hot to you and you love that person, that should be all that you need, right? I mean, those are three key Correct. factors of knocking the boots. Now, if there's no sex in there, something's something's afoot, right? Something's aloof. Something's wrong. Oh, but that attraction is supposed to make way for love, right? So you have the hot. I think you can grow to love anything. anything. I think you can grow to love anything. Anything. Mm. I mean, I hated Brie. That is a great example. I hated that woman with every ounce of my soul. And if I could fall in love with her, you could. And that's not Stockholm syndrome. What's that called when the captivator falls in love with the person? The opposite yep. of Stockholm syndrome. That's, no, Sto that's Stockholm. No, no, that's no Stockholm no. is where the victim falls in love with the captivator. Yes. Yes. No, I'm talking about what's it yes. called when a captivator falls in love with the person? Stalking. <laughs> <laughs> that works too. <laughs> Psycho Okay. All right. That's, I think that's the plot of the movie The Town. Yeah, I mean, there's, I'm sure it, it is a thing, but but either way, I, 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 and that usually happens when you get married, right? That, that's what happens. You you get to a point where you both get comfortable, and then you your love light dissipates, and then you do separate things, and then that's Taking it. Taking away your freedom, you're a captive, <laughs> and then you fall lo uh, in love again. One and of the two. Wonder why people don't want to get married. <laughs> well, that has multiple reasons why. Mm -hmm. A good example, but I think it's the only example. I think sex is such a, an important part of a relationship, and if it doesn't exist, 80% 80, 80 of a good relationship is having enough sex. Yeah, 75 to 85%. And that's been proven. I don't know what me and my last wife were on. We must have been on that other 5% of some shit because that was strong, I guess, right? I, I guess if we have 5%, and that's what we're holding on by for years. But wasn't that more of a, in, in, in the end, a more sister-brother no, kind of love? A friend, like, not even a friend, just, you know, well, like, I, if she called me up right now, I would do something for her. You know, I'd help her out. Mm. I wouldn't eat her pussy or anything. I might, like, hit her from the back. But, I, you know, I'll see what I can do <laughs> and call some people. I got a dude in Belgium you can marry and get him here quicker. Uh, you know, I, let's figure it out. But I... I <laughs> I, I don't I don't know. I just have a problem with people, bro. I have a problem when I reach out to people, you know. Uh, I'm a person too, but the problem is me becoming a person and making myself on someone's level and not being better than them only 
hurts my pocket in the long run and hurts my feelings. Those are facts. Those are facts. Yeah, the the reverence of, or reverence, what's the correct way to say it? Reverence. The reverence is down the drain and then... You have to be better than everybody. Think about it. Yeah. You have to be. I am better than you. And you have to keep telling me yourself that. Maybe a little feared as well. Of course. Look at God, right? Feared, but people love him. I'm not saying I'm God. I might be, but I'm, I'm not saying I am. Oh, in this crazy world, you can identify as well anything be. you want. Sure. <laughs> yes. You'd have to start talking about yourself in the third person, though. Right? <laughs> <laughs> More of a godly sign. I always found that creepy when people do that. When they, like, you remember Batman reviews? He would always talk to himself in the third and fourth person. You're probably asking yourself, what's a fourth person? That's when the third person is talking about himself again. <laughs> I'm, I'm still looking up. There's a fourth person. Like, that's how he would speak. No. And when I would say it, there's no such thing. Yes, there is. You're speaking fourth person, bro. Like, you got to stop this. This is weird. I, I feel like that's people who have complexes or some shit. Like, you got to distance yourself so far from yourself. <laughs> That's going to have a Latin name, like 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 a cuckoo yeah, name, right? No? Three people so, in front so, of you that are all you? Oh, shit. And, and what happens if the fourth person is talking shit behind your back? That's a whole it's, other he's got The second person is going to let the first person know. Oh. <laughs> so the and third, the third person, one is trustworthy. So it's not can, a, it's not can people name. be fixed? Can you fix people? No, right? They are who they are. No, the uh, people, people can fix is, themselves. Is, you can't fix them. Go ahead, you John. can fix individuals, you, and then eventually it grows into people. <laughs> you have to go you, through every... You can't just do population as a whole. You have to fix individuals. I'm and, talking about that friend individual. thing. That's what I'm talking about, that friend thing. Uh, yeah, influence but it people, maybe. It's like brainwashing. I think more waterboarding than <laughs> A little more aggressive. Uh, <laughs> just... The thing is, if a person has made up his mind and he doesn't want anything to do you, with you and he doesn't want to be your friend at, all, at any cost, what are you going to do about that? You're going to force him to be your friend? Write That's... him off, right? That's the answer. Write him off. Yeah, you write him off. That's it. That's it. That one I mean, first you would have the conversation with the person and be like, hey, listen, done. what's the deal? That's that's yeah, that's and if done. it hasn't fixed, then yeah. then you just, you know, part your way. Is that the same thing with being married? I would sure mm. hope so, because you should be able to talk to your significant other. No, no, no. We're talking about leaving. Is it you do the same thing with oh. your wife? That this ain't working out? Uh, listen, things have got to fix or I'm out? Do you yeah, have why to not? be friends to be married? I'm sorry, did you ask, do you have to be friends to be married? What? Yeah, your, spouse what is supposed is to be your, your spouse is supposed to be your best friend as well, I right? Agree. I agree. I you should be able to tell your spouse anything. Everything. And it yeah. goes, it should be accepted, right? It should be accepted. You should be able to say you even off somebody. And that should stay with that individual forever. Will that happen mm -hmm. with most marriages today? No. And that's what I was well, because people practice, are getting married for the wrong nice reasons. On, nice thought on paper. In practice, however. No. That ain't that ain't happening. Uh uh. No. But is it weird that I getting... trust more men? Here here comes the heat of the stream. Is it weird that I trust more men than women? No. I'm sorry, I said that I said that wrong. I said that wrong. Is it weird that I trust more women than I do men? Yep. You think that's weird? Yeah, I think it's strange. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah. 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 You guys trust like men this. more than you do women? If you were to tell yeah, your because... your guys, your friends, your male friends, some shit that you did, you know that they're gonna go tell somebody, right? Like you know that their wife, would... their friend. I would expect them if it's a real friend to like the. 
I've got a shovel. And I've, a got, I've got a shovel. I've got a light. And wh where do, where do you want to go to bury it? I mean, oh, hold on. You're making it sound like the woman won't go telling everybody else. If you're friends with a woman, and I'm using the definition of friends, if you're friends with a woman, you're friends with a man, the woman is going to hold that more dear to her heart than what the man is. You really think yeah, so? Why, why does a man, wrong. let's, let's do, let's go deep in this. Let's go. Cause we like very uh, psychological conversations, right? Very philosophical. Who's the first to cheat in a relationship, a man or a woman? Ooh. A woman. The answer is a woman. That's what the answer is. Statistically, it's a woman. And why do you think that the woman cheats? Oh, connection. Lack that's of connection. Right. That's right. It's not for sex. It's for love. She wants yep. someone to love her. Whether sex is involved or not is irrelevant. The man, on the other hand, cheats because he's just fucking horny. Okay? Mm -hmm. yeah. So you have those two Purely right physical. there. So which one do you think would be the better friend? The one that loves you or the one that just wants to go out for himself? Think about that. Yeah, I, I, I agree. But isn't that oh. like a woman? For a woman, love is gone when she cheats. For a man, like you said, he's horny. He can still love his wife who's sitting at home, but he can go do Sometimes his thing. Sometimes I with, sprinkle uh, when I tinkle. Okay, but a man, but okay. Using that analogy that I just used, a man is going to take care of himself. So if a man is being inter interrogated by a bunch of detectives about what his friend did, you don't think that he's going to fucking squeal if it saves his ass? It depends on that person's loyalty level. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here. So when we used to do we interrogations... Don't, don't listen, when we used to do interrogations in Guantanamo Bay, do you know who the last to speak were? The wives. The women. The women, the women and the children. Do you know why? for fear of being killed by their significant others. That's why. So, now that might be different, right? Because that's, <laughs> I feel like that's a little different uh, because of the culture, but it's, it, it's still, there's a point to be made there. Yeah, but it still that's could hold up fear. for the men as well. If there's fear of someone bigger and stronger, then you're motivated by fear to keep your mouth shut. Right. I mean, how many mob guys have gone strong. to prison not saying anything? And then how many of them after five years start writing biographies of all the shit that they did? <laughs> well, that's because they want to make <laughs> I money. I think all of them. Al Capone did it. Gotti did it. I think they all do. Like, no, all right, I've been here for 15 by years. Money. I think I've been here for fucking 15 years. Nobody's sending me commissary anymore. I can't buy my yodels. Uh, I'm done, bro. I'm done. So I'm I'm telling you everything you need to know. Um, they all do it. So, and that's dudes. Yeah, right. Now flip it and tell me how many women flipped on what they did. Look at Bonnie and Clyde. That is a great example. Who faltered out of the two, Bonnie or Clyde? I'm not before sure. they took their own lives. Nobody knows the story of Bonnie and Clyde. I know the story of did Bonnie Clyde and Clyde, but I didn't think I didn't know anybody flipped. Hmm? The first time I got arrested. Oh, the first time. Oh, I don't remember. Yeah. It wasn't Bonnie. I could tell you that much. It was Clyde. He did. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, but if they... I trust women more than I do men. 100%. Because they know emotion is tied to what I'm saying to them. And you cry to a woman, she'll give you her vagina. You cry to a man, he'll call you a pussy. Come on, how do we not agree with this? Because there are, there's also women, the moment they see you, you as a man cry, they, lo they, they, they lose I all agree, respect yeah, I, I would be that woman, by the way. I would be that But woman. I think You're that's that woman pussy, that's bro. with you, though. <laughs> I think that's the woman that's with you, not the woman who you're talking to the side to. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. I, I just, I, I have different experiences. All the women I know would, mm -hmm. I could tell anything and, They'll take that shit to the grave. It could be just my chance with women. Um, yeah, I'd say it's probably that because overall, I feel like they share more than we do. We keep a lot of shit. Maybe amongst the hold on, maybe amongst each other, but we're talking about the nitty gritty, get you in trouble, go to jail. That's what I'm talking about. The severe punishment. I feel like you could trust a woman more than you can a man. 
I never thought of it from that perspective. Severe no, punishment, death, it. beating, whatever. Bell time. Yes, yeah. yes. Not like I she's telling her friends that you got a tiny dick. Yeah, I don't trust women that in that regard at all. No, 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 no. Yes, right. I agree. Uh, I'm talking about tell them a secret that only they can they can hold on to. <clears throat> I, maybe it's my good looks. I don't know. I, I, I'm not trying to be funny. I, maybe that's what it is. But I, I've never had a woman flip on me. Men? Oh yes. Mm-hmm. But I, I don't really have that many girlfriends right. to actually have any conversation. So, nope, can't can't kind really of, give an opinion. Kind of does flip though when we're talking about uh, domestic. Uh, I, I don't know if you can say it in, on here. Domestic. I got it. Aggravated. Domestic domestic things. Yes. Yeah. Um, you're saying like when the cops show up. Yeah, and and so, women complain to, to, to the world that oh, but men usually don't. That's because it it makes them um, it makes a man look like right. That, mm-hmm. that that's for different reasons. That's that's different reasons. She's reaching out again. That's for ego. Help friendship. That you're proving my point. Um, <laughs> she's looking for love, help, friendship. He doesn't want to do it because he doesn't want his ego shattered by all his boys that are like, you let that woman throw a laundry basket at your head? Really? You're a fucking pussy. Um, you know. I, well, if they did tell my secrets, I would be in jail. So, uh, yes, I know that they have not told my secrets. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I already know that. I like I'm here now. So yes, my secrets are pretty fucking secure. Uh, <laughs> and now we have statute of limitations. So even if it did come out, I'm free anyway. It's been like 22 years. Uh, <laughs> but then you've you, you we're you, good. Like you said, you, you've been lucky with women that right, never that, want that, to pay sure. back because sure. A woman scorns. That saying is that that saying is true, right? Hell hath no but fury like a woman so. scorned. Yeah, yeah. But then, okay. So make- let, let, let's. So, what's a better friend, a man or a woman? We're gonna break this down by sex. I think for different things, different no, no. people. In general, bro. In general, somebody you could fucking rely on. Supposed to be your. <laughs> Uh, forget wives we're just saying friends i know it's weird because a lot of us don't have girlfriends right but i know well, you've got some things. girlfriends spade i've seen your facebook friends you got some who do you think you can rely on more and we're not going to use pancakes because that motherfucker's desperate <laughs> but if you oh, i think he's you, right or not I, I oh, yeah. wouldn't doubt that i think he's the best friend that you will ever fucking have even if you hate him um, <laughs> But I, I'm saying, like, if someone dies, right, who's going to be the first at the funeral? The man or the woman? The woman. Because <coughs> like the friendship, love, hold their hands, caring. A man is just like, it, it's weird for, here, watch. Join. And I'm not joking. Watch this. I'm going to do this publicly. Join. I love you, man. I do. I love you. Most men can't do that. Again, we go back to the ego. Women, on the other hand, they will joke around with that shit like they're lovers. Why is that? Oh, that's kind of the, that comes back from society. Then we've so all the been brought friend? up. With- You're being more open and honest with it, with a woman than you are a man. Yeah, but that's allowed. Well, well, well in a society, you, don't, you could you right. could be a you could be a hamster. And uh, Whatever. I'm fall in love with that, yeah. so uh, I don't. I don't know yeah. about that argument. I think it's the, re- the the reasoning is because your friends would rag on you because of what you did and what you told them. So you don't want to get ragged on. So you're going to not trust them anymore. In that regard, you understand what I'm saying? Like, for argument's sakes, if if Bree turned around and threw the basket at your head, right? Mm-hmm. But you didn't want to tell anybody for fear that one of us would make fun of you because of that, 
You're just like, I, I'll, I won't okay, say anything. Okay, so it goes back to my question, and it's who do you yeah. trust more? Right, so that's why... So who's I, I the first, better friend? I, would you tell another woman so that? Woman of course would you would. Right. You would tell right. another woman, I don't want you to be like my ex that would throw laundry baskets at my head. Right. But you won't tell your buddy, which tells you right. that you trust the woman more than you right. do a man. Right, that's that's what I was getting at because be originally more. I would have said a man, but now right. now the I, way you're explaining it, I'm I, going I don't know. I, I I feel like I could trust a woman more than I can a man. Well, that's yeah, I, yeah that's trust, I guess. It's it's, it's how more many watch this? How many female phone. hazers? Watch this. How many? Well, I got proof. I, you want proof? I got proof. How many female hazers we've had over the past four years? Watch this. Less watch than us. ten in the total. Less than ten. How many are left? Three. We'll say no. We're, let's go percent because we have to go by percents because the numbers are going to be oh. drastically different. So let's go sixty percent. Sixty percent. How many men have been hazers? Yeah. How many are gone? How many I got left? About three. Three percent. Ah, oh, see. Yeah. Ah, that's it. That that that's factual numbers there. Who can you trust more? Who can you trust and not get offended? The women. The women. I mean, mm. the numbers don't lie, right? Mm. No, they don't. No, they don't. Numbers are in line, so yeah. I, I I mean, tell me a different story where it's not. I, I I'd be interested. You 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 know they have that clause, right? If you do a crime and shit, I don't know if they have it in Belgium, but in America they got this lovely yeah, they got this little mm -hmm. wife, they got this little lovely thing. You could commit murder, commit murder, and your wife watch. She doesn't. She, she can't, you go can't on force her to testify. <clears throat> you can't. There are some states where that does not apply, but federally, that's lock solid. Like that's. Hmm. See, Bree disagrees with me. Women will spill all of your secrets in a heartbeat if they're pissed so off too. at you. Yeah. If they're pissed off at you. You're right, you're right. If they're, but not if you're friends. Not if you're friends. If you're friends, why would yeah, they do that? That's not what we're talking about, Brie. I'll agree with that. If you irritate a woman, she'll dump everything. Like she'll, right. she'll call the cops. She'll she'll make shit up. She'll just yeah. Like she'll lie you. about it. Oh she yeah, exactly. as long as you're friends. As long as you're friends, or she's otherwise right. That's what I'm talking about. Friends, you. friends. You guys are otherwise. Friends. Agree. Yeah, but women will absolutely. They'll put you on the cross and uh, drive the nail in as well. They'll in, they'll invent stuff get to get you into trouble. She'll make a TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a possibility. <laughs> it's always impossible. <laughs> I don't know. I just I, I just don't piss a woman off, right? Piss a man off. What are you gonna do? You punch in the face. You're gonna drink a beer. Yeah, and after that, you have a drink. Fun. Yeah, it's, it's yeah, whatever. Yeah. It's women will hold those grudges till they die. And definitely, yeah. You know, Buckeye has a good question. Has a good. I point, have a good though. answer to that because they also had uh, goombas, right? They also had little. Oh, the, the gumars, the gumars. Yeah, yeah they had, uh, people that they were fucking on the side. So we're not going to talk about their integrity. Hmm. We're not going to talk and about also, that. if if you're talking about the mafia, you have to recognize how strong are they now? Like, where are they? Maybe. Well, well isn't that an old saying? Hold on. Every good man is a good woman. Isn't that a right? saying? Yes. Yes, it is. And it's pretty accurate. I and agree men with that. As agree. much as I don't agree with this, men do listen to their wives. They do. Yeah. And we have yeah. proof of that one, too. Just to an extreme level. But yeah. there should also be reasoning, right? You don't want me to do this? Tell me yes. why. This is why I want to do it? Okay, fine. I'm going to let you slow. You but, have okay. that conversation, yes. right? Yes, you have that conversation. Yes, of course. Yes, of course. Is that, it goes is both that ways. listening or is that forced? I think it's caring. Because there's a different. No. I think it's no. There was a, it's there, there was a shift in power in that specific uh, example. We're and talking the about the Willet one? So, uh, or the Dan yes. one? Or... With which I there's so many, Pick whatever. Okay, let's go with, uh, let's go with the Dan one. Let's go with the Dan one. Yeah, okay, her house, her rules. Same for okay. so there's a difference in power level. Then it's not you deciding to listen, you have no choice. There is no choice. You're either homeless, right? The choice would be is either homeless or adhere to what I'm saying. 
But who the fuck wants to be in a relationship like that? Uh, Where someone can hold you to the fire every single time you do something that they don't like? What well, kind of relationship is that? It's not a. It's not a. It's a a it's fine, Matthew. I'm just saying that. Uh, okay, I, I don't understand. A submissive nope. one. That's that's the answer. <clears throat> well, this is gonna. This opinion is gonna piss people off even more. I think it should be. Would you listen to what your wife has to say? Yes. Her input. Okay. At the end of the day, the decision is still the man's. What he wants to do. 100%. 100%. Same thing with mother, father. Same thing. Even in movies, they agree. Go ask your father. Go ask your father. Go ask your father. Yeah, like, I I agree. I, I, as much as, unless, of course, the roles are reversed, where the woman is making all the money and making all the decisions. Then you really have no power. Your power of a man is essentially obsolete. Filch. Yeah, like you don't do anything. You're a house mom, house dad. That's a complete. That's why everyone wants to. That's why everyone wants to change their gender because they're like, well, I'm sitting at home doing nothing because I'm not. <laughs> well, why that? There could be a message there, man. Why do you think all these dudes want to have a vagina? Because they realize how much the power of pussy has. The difference is yeah. you don't have pussies. You are one, but you don't have one. <laughs> mm -hmm. They could pay for one, right? They could pay for one. Sure. Wait, so if, if I declare myself a woman now, I can get a guy in here and he pays for everything? Nice. Matthew, with your looks, no. No. You're too Gandalfy. Oh. <laughs> you know, to, and I've never watched Lord of the Rings. Gandalfy. Um, Nailed Harry second Potter movie Potter. reference in. Nice. Did I really? I like wow. You nailed two two movie wow. references. Look at that. Yeah. See that? I could change. I could movies I hate. <laughs> I bet you've been it's, watching uh, that one it channel. It looks like you what found you your fourth member, Spade. <laughs> you've been watching that channel, right, Jay? What's it called? Uh, closed final, captions? No. Uh, final, final, the final, final, final caption? The sub, sub Yeah, the closed, the closed captioning. The closed, yeah, the closed the captioning. captioning. Yes. The subtitles. The su <laughs> I like the that. That's a good one. <laughs> yeah. I, I, so next next week, Spain is going to have three channels now. One called Subtitles. <laughs> for the, for the <laughs> and each okay. one's going to have different Every, staff. Yeah. Why not? Jesus, that's Why a not? Lot of people. <laughs> well, if, yeah, if you're just going to change... If you're going to change, Matthew, I think the return of investment is going to be bad. The amount of money you have to put up to make you an attractive woman. Oh, how much? <sighs> how much would you give up, Matthew? This is a good one. How much would you give up to have a brand new heart? Or what would you give up? Oh, completely healthy. Oh, what would you? Give, what would you give up or take? A lot. Would you kill someone? If you knew 100% uh, that you would be 100% healthy. Oh, go deeper. Uh, kill somebody. Is it an innocent person or is it? Doesn't matter. It doesn't, that there's is not it a someone people. you know. It could be anybody. It could be anybody. It doesn't matter. That's a tough one. I have to think about you that. Could go, you could go biblical, sacrifice the son. Oof. Yeah, maybe. You're being funny. You don't mean that. Yeah. That's true. yeah. <clears throat> the child protective services is Liz watching. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> He's still alive. I'll show you on stream. Still alive. You know what's crazy, bro? You. Ray was reading the uh, the lottery things. You guys were on the stream, right? The one in 112 million to get yeah. killed by a vending machine. Um, nobody has won the Powerball in Florida or the Mega Millions in the past five months. They're both at one billion dollars. Oh one shit! Billion. Really? Wow! A billion. <laughs> Think it, it, it would would it be hard to get wrap your head around or to fathom the the amount of money that you win. Uh yeah, but winning it in Florida is a. Uh... 
No, but there's bound you to be somebody that won't sometime. You can't disappear. That's that's the problem. Everyone well, will know that you have that money. You can disappear with one billion dollars. Yes, you can. Yeah, yeah, you could. Like yeah, that you in your could. bank account, and you go to Buenos Aires. You, Yo, you, you go know to what's even country. more crazy? So I was reading up on what happens if you win the lottery. Because again, I got a lot of eggs in this basket. I know it's one in three hundred million, but I got a lot of eggs in this basket for my own reasons. Did you know that a lot of people take those? I, this is crazy. They take the money, and you know where they put it? Watch this. You win the lottery. What do you? What would you? What, what do you? What? Where do you go with that money? What do you do? The bank. Several. What, several what bank? banks. Uh, okay, what bank? Major bank, right? You go Either America yeah. or Switz Chase. Switzerland. Switzerland. So you would go to a different country for a bank. Yes, Switzerland okay. or Cayman Islands. You ready for this? Ninety-four percent of the lottery winners that save their money is the key here. Ninety-four mm percent. -hmm. They put it in private banks. Why? Oh. Higher interest rate. Fuck the no, higher interest rate. Uh, no obligation to tell you what, what's happening with the money or tell the government. But oh, really? That would be the last place that I would put my money because what happens if that bank goes bankrupt? Bye -bye. Well, you have, your money's gone. You're, you're, you're insured. Wait, hold on, guys. No, you're insured for 300K by the FDIC. 250. 250K. Yeah, yeah, but if you've got a billion in your bank account, uh, well, that's the thing, though. You don't put all of it in one basket, right? You what are you crazy? You win a billion dollars, you put ten million dollars in a four percent savings account, you live off of that shit for the rest of your life. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. Fuck that 250 cap. Private banks. What's you, the private bank? What's the private bank would be like bank Joe's just... bank, you know, yeah. Melissa and Bob's. Bank at this people. point, with all that money, you can become a bank. <laughs> you can take better. that money and become a bank and make start more money. Own, yeah, start up your own bank. That's it. Do loans. I don't think it's that easy. And, and whatever. Yeah, I don't think it's that easy. No. As long as you have the capital for it, I think it is. Yeah, but you don't have the name. You know how long it's going to yeah, take that, for people to trust you? If that was possible, you? because a because Amex dropped, um, not Amex, Goldman and Sachs and Apple broke their broke their contract. They're done, and Apple right. won't start their own bank, and they've got enough of customers, so it can't be that easy just to start a new bank. But that's because does. But that's the thing, though. Apple is looking at it. Do I want to hire another bunch of people in order to create another faction of my company? I think that's how they're looking at it. It might be more of a headache than it is, you know, profitable. Can start a yes, Apple, can, Apple, Apple can put their finger in every single industry with the amount of money that they have. In every single industry, they could put Wouldn't it be smart to put the dollars. money? You want insurance on the money? Wouldn't it be smart to put it in stocks? Hoping that no, the because... stock market doesn't crash. But right, exactly. I, I, I like. I was trying to think. Can you actually insure money? I don't think you can. There's no way. I don't think so. You could buy gold. If you buy the gold, the gold. Where are you gonna put those gold bars, bro? In your house? What are you, an idiot? You'd have to build Fort Knox in your house. Pretty sure if you have gold bars, you buy a lot of them. You can just leave them in the bank. And where do you go buy gold bars from? It's not like there's a gold bar vendor around the corner. Tiffany's? No, I don't know. No, not Tiffany's. No. Imagine getting a gold brick in that in that teal box. <laughs> I would just do property. Here's your brick. Mm -hmm. Buy a lot of property and then yeah, rent I mean, that's, it out. And as far as, but it would be nice if you could insure it. You know, you could say, okay, I have three hundred fifty. My need that insured, but right, yeah. I'm pretty like sure said, certain banks, especially in Switzerland, where most of the rich people keep their money anyway, they'll have some nice insurance for you. It's weird that you would go private. Is that because then you do it locally that, and then you have some extra? I think. I, I don't know. It, they, they don't really get into the details for obvious reasons, but um, ninety-four percent of the people that save it, they they do private banking. And when I think of private banking, I think of 
Jack's Credit Union. Right. And that's the last person I'm going to give all of my money to. I'm sorry. That would be the, that would be the last one. That's, but is it but because maybe, they live in a small maybe. hood? Could like they be. live in a yeah. small neighborhood and the smaller banks that's, are there? That's, that's what I'm thinking now. So you go to a local bank. It already has not a lot of money laying around. Now you're actually getting into an agreement with the bank. You put in 250, 350, but they can loan that money out. So they split they the interest money. rate with you. Because they don't have a lot of money laying around. But, then you're, but like I said, then you're better off just becoming a, a loaning office or whatever, and you loan it out no, yourself. Because then, no, because you no. take all the risk. No, you don't want you to do take that. all the risk. No, now the bank is taking the risk. It's just getting get a credit. A lot yeah, but you're okay. But the bank is now giving out your money. They take the risk. If you want your money, right. they still have to pay you back the two fifty you put in. Right. And if you loan it yourself, and the people split. Even if you okay, took a billion dollars and you put two hundred and fifty thousand dollars, there's not enough fucking banks in the world to get you know to one billion. Like. You could go to every bank everywhere, and you're you're gonna run out of banks. But I think it, yeah. at that point you're just diversifying as much money as you can to get a revenue stream going. You don't everywhere. care about the total money. It's just that's some drinking money. You go get yourself a nice lobster every day. It's just I think that's the better the question. Fuck winning the lottery. What do you do with the winnings? Like to hold it? Where do you put it? Yeah. You're not gonna go to Bank of America. I mean, uh, you can only withdraw ten thousand a day. That sucks. So, what, what? Why are you buying everything in cash if you have all this money? Just use your debit card and charge you it up. You can't though. They all have limits. So then you have a credit card linked to that account. Like you get a secured credit card, right? Where you, have, I guess you could do. I don't I think you, you could. Do that. I, yeah, I don't think you could have over ten million on a credit card. I think that is the cap. All right, so you have Unless forty you of those. those. Unless you get that American yeah. Express black card, <laughs> <laughs> probably be eligible for one of those. Yeah, they would. Yeah, point. they would see. But are you really going to spend more than ten thousand dollars a day? Like the highest credit card mm-hmm. limit ever issued is two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. It's ever mm. issued by American Express. Not a and charge that's card. Black? That's a no. That's a charge card. Uh, a, a, a credit, like a credit card, uh, Visa, Mastercard, Discover, two hundred fifty thousand dollars. At least in America. Two fifty. I wonder I'm what saying, the reason. I don't, I don't even know. Is. I don't even know how you would spend it every day. You have to walk around with cash. <laughs> Mm. You better have a like, team of security guards with you or something, a team of, of cops or something. I don't know. Right. Where are you going to keep the billion dollars in, 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 in notes? I mean, well, first of all, you're not going to get a billion dollars. Remember, taxes pull everything out. You're going to get half of that. Are you ready for this? 25% that take off the jump, right? Watch this. Right. When you make $500,000 on a lot of, I've done way too much research on this. $500,000. Um, so now, anything over five hundred thousand dollars, you win the lottery. Twenty-five off the jump, and then fifteen percent when you claim your taxes. They take forty percent. Mm-hmm. They don't tell you that though. So what happens is you take that twenty-five as soon as you're getting that check. Guess what? That's great. We'll see you in six months when you have to claim that for your last year, and everybody spent their money already. Uh oh. Mm-hmm. Uh oh. That's why. That's why. Even if you win a billion Uh-oh. dollars, you're only going to get five hundred million, right? And that's still no a lot way. of money. And that's a paying billion. You only. make uh, six, six forty, six hundred forty. Okay, no, that's still even it's if still you, a bro, even that's ten a million. Like take half. Who gives a shit? <laughs> who fucking cares? Here's like, a tip. A take shit? some extra. Yeah, go ahead. Here's one on a house. Who cares? And anybody that complains about that, you're ridiculous. You haven't spent that much money on lottery tickets. You're fine. See, prime example of human nature. I won a million, but I have to give, or a billion, but then I oh. only receive 640 in the end? Only. Right, but watch this, though. So you know how you get around that 15%? You donate 5% to a charity of your choice. Ding, ding. Mm-hmm. Done. 
You just saved yourself 10% of 640 fucking million. Hmm. So I was I was at a gas station yesterday with a friend. We walked into the gas station. I was getting a bottle of water and he was uh, paying for gas and buying some uh, some other stuff. So he told the lady, he's like, yeah, can I get a quick pick? Can I get this? Can I get that? So afterwards, she uh, she gives him the receipts and whatnot. She goes, good luck to him. He's like, thank you. And I turned around. And I told her I was like, well, if, if he wins, he'll give you one percent. You know what this bitch said? Only 1%? I was like, are you serious? 1% is better than nothing. Why does he deserve anything? I was anything? arguing. I just said that as a joke. Like, oh, if right. he wins. Yeah, no, I would say. Yeah, and I'd be and the she, guy and behind she got you. Upset. She got upset because I said 1%. Look, I wouldn't be upset. I'll be real. If one of you won the lottery and you didn't give me at least 5%, I'm writing you off. We're done. <laughs> <laughs> But this isn't nobody, though. This is somebody that you just saw I'm sorry, at, I'm a, at a gas real. station. <laughs> just being honest, it's five percent. I mean, that still gives you ninety-five to keep. Hook, Wait, hook me up. is that past winnings as well? Because I won twenty bucks, and I no, 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 no. <laughs> I only care when it's over a million. You <laughs> win five hundred. Oh, okay, I got you. Yeah, yeah, I got yeah. you. I'm, it's not, like, ah. I'm not greedy, right? I'm not greedy. I was That's holding up. Crazy. Yeah. I felt like I was so holding out. A million and up. Uh, <laughs> million and up. I need five percent. That's okay. Seems so fair. Yeah. I give it to you. Make it make it make it more fair. Five percent after taxes. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, okay. I want that all yeah. in big bills what? only. Wait, you well, want me? You want to get better it. off? I want you it all in singles. I don't. I would love that. I would love to see that. If me or well, Jordan wins, bills, or... we don't have to pay taxes on it. That's the problem, though, bro. Like, I thought about that. If I win and someone claims it, and then they give me money, then I'm taxed on that as income. So no matter what, I got to do it myself. Other question. So Just even if you gave me cash. money, unless you dropped it off to me, uh, you give me money, hey, I'm going to be taxed on cash. that as income. Give it in cash. What about if I don't give it? What if I don't give it in cash? What if I give it in goods, and you sell it then? Still same tax rate? No, you still because now you have the law that states that if you're making money off of selling things, no, because you're selling things, you're making a profit now, not a profit. I wouldn't be taxed. The person person buying it would be taxed, not me. If he bought me a Lamborghini, gave me the title, said, "Here, this is yours." All right, this is yours. Okay, and it was a gift. Would the tax collector at DMV in Florida agree with that? I don't know. I'd have to get a lawyer, ta- a good tax lawyer. But if I sold it, I wouldn't be taxed. The person buying it is taxed. Mm-hmm. And I originally originally already paid taxes on when I first bought the Lamborghini. So that that kind of falls in line with money laundering, but um, yeah. No, 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 not really. I'm giving you a gift. Yeah, but I'm you know what you I'm going to do with the gift, right? Like, you, you know what I'm going to do with it, the intent. Oh, I didn't know. I didn't know. Oh. <laughs> but I'll I testify to this. Yeah, I but I know. did. Right, he so that clears you of money laundering, but that doesn't clear me. Five <laughs> percent of a billion? Five percent of a billion? That's going to be how many Ferraris? Uh, that's that's going to be noticeable. No. Well, let's say, let's say, and the, the, instead of uh, giving uh, Jay or anyone on this panel X amount of millions, one million or, or so, I buy that in property. You get less money. I give you the gift, but that all that all those properties, one or two or three apartments, are now reven- uh, giving you revenue. Let's say mm-hmm. rent money. It's it's less money that you get in your pocket right now, but in a year or five years, you get that. Rent money altogether. Plus it's more. Be plus a- more. Right. Yeah. Then that like, same argument you're using there is you get taxed less if you take the yearly payments instead of yes. taking a lump sum. So mm-hmm. more people should s- select that then instead of taking out the lump sum. But they but don't people, know People get so greedy. Way. People get so greedy yes. that they won. They're like, ooh. Uh, that's, that's the thing. I... I the nice 
a sum of money, like getting X amount of millions is nice, but you also have, to, you probably got, uh, have it as well, is, uh, what is it called, Matthew? The, the win for life, win for life thing. And yeah. it's a, a set uh, amount you get every month. I would rather have that. That's 5, 5K or 10K it goes now a month. Yeah, I'll take that over the yeah, millions but, right now. But those are kind of... Everything over 2K, it's it's actually, you don't win that even if you scratch it off. Oh, I won. You haven't actually won yet. You go into a pool. No. And then True. X oh, amount of like nice. are chosen. So, yeah, and if you win yeah. the lottery, you know what's crazy here? You know what they say? Is if you win the lottery, don't tell anybody. That's obvious, right? Because no, now someone's yeah. going to come look for you. They say... Sign the back of the ticket. We're talking about the, the lottery thing. Sign the back mm -hmm. of the ticket. Put it inside of a dry lock. So, no, it can't get wet. It can't, like, almost the safe. And then go f fill it out and whatever. You bring it to the place in Tallahassee. But here's the worst part. You win. Do you know how long it takes before you get your first check or your payout? Well, yeah, I always wondered that. What is that? It, six months. Six, six to eight weeks. So, you have oh, to okay. wait. Oh. No, not oh, okay. You know that you just won the lottery. You gotta wait six weeks. That's not that long. Look, mm -hmm. here's the here's the deal, lady. What if you die tomorrow? Watch us. Watch us. Here's the deal, lady. I won. You know that, right? We have this all documented. You could take three million if you manage to get me that check <laughs> within the next week. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to start bribing people before I even have the money. Here's the deal. <laughs> 10 million is yours if you get me that check quicker. Six to eight over weeks. Here, <clears throat> over here, they do kind of advise you to take it in, in a couple of payments. Separate. Everything yeah. at the same time. Yeah, because they don't want to give it to you all at you once. Yeah, they don't want to write that check out. No, if you want win big and you have to go to the lottery and it's over X amount of millions... You get uh, like a guidance counselor yeah. or, or, or whatever, and they, they guide Financial you through advisor. the process. Yeah. yeah. So they, can, they actually give you support instead yeah, because of they know most okay, people lose go their money right away. and buy five castles. Do you think you would start would spending nice the money before you even got it? Like, do you think? No. <laughs> you would well, probably. yes. Yes, because See, that's I know I where my nice. first 800K is going. Go on, what you gonna say, See, that's what I was going to ask next is like, you could go up to the bank and say, Hey, listen, can I take out a loan for 30 days? Well, why 30 days? Well, because in six weeks I'm going to have all this money so I could pay you guys back right away. But can I take the money out now Ooh, so I can go on a spending spree? I don't know spree? about that. I don't know about that. Or, okay. How about this? You turn around and you're saying now that it takes eight weeks. Let's just say the long term, eight weeks to get your money, right? You go to the bank and say, hey, I'd like to buy that house over there. What's your income? Oh, I, I don't have any income right now. But in eight weeks, I just won a billion dollars from the lottery. Can I get can I get the money? Okay, can I get the loan? I think it, I think it comes down to what do you need now this moment that you can't nothing. wait for six to eight nothing. weeks for? Nothing. Okay, the reality yeah, is nothing. Okay. Not unless you're sick and you need to do surgeries or something. Other than that, I don't think it really matters. Yeah, that's true. But then winning the lottery is probably not one of the, your first concerns. If you're one in 300 bad. million, bro, you have better chances to get hit by lightning. Twice. I like the vending machine one. The <laughs> vending machine. Yeah, the vending vending chances, you have better chances of a giraffe killing you. And you're from America. One in 248 million. A giraffe. Where the fuck yeah, what about the a giraffe in America? A yeah, zoo. Is, a so if you're a... One in 248 million, bro. When do you ever leave your house thinking I'm going to die by giraffe today? <laughs> unless, unless you frequent the zoo often, then your chances are going... Even then, bro, up. when is a giraffe going to run into you and run you over? I mean, like, those well, odds are ridiculous. Good. I think people made that up. There's no way it could be true, man. It's like, true, you, bro. These are true numbers. What, you do you know lightning? It? Lightning getting struck is one in 57,000. It's that common. One in yeah. 57,000. 
Do you go outside of your house thinking you're going to get struck by lightning? I don't know about you, but after I read those stats, Mm -hmm. and I I wanted to have Bree bring in the garbage yesterday because it was raining. I said, (laughs) my luck is I'm going to get fucking struck by lightning. I talked about it. Now it's going to happen. Right? So it's just the odds, bro, are really stacked against you. I mean, they are stacked, bro. Have you have you looked up the odds of a piano dropping on your head and killing you, like like That's the cool. Acme version, <laughs> like the classic Acme version? No, bro, it can't be. Hey, it what? Be that like, high. Better... The odd, the, listen to this. The odds of dying of heart disease. This is grim as shit, bro. One and Oof. six. Cancer, one Oof. and seven. Oof. Opioid overdose, one of 58. Here we go. Wow. That's... You have a one in three hundred million chance of dying in a fairground or a carnival accident. One in eleven million. See now, this is this is interesting. One in eleven million for a plane crash. But when you hmm. get on a plane, you think about that, don't you? Yeah. So a car is more dangerous, but you think about it less. Less. Well, yeah, like because every time you get into a car, you're gonna. Oh, I might die in this car today because of a wreck or whatever. Well, that's why they say statistically, it's safer to pl- to fly than it is to drive. Right. Of course, when a plane goes Which down, it's much more televised and uh, spectacular, and yeah, more people die at the same oh, time. No. Probably the loss of life. This is way bigger. Mm. That's why. The odds of sudden death where you just die. You ready for this number? One in 625,000. Oh, wow. You have better odds of just waking up to not wake. Well, no, that would <laughs> never be waking up dead. No, you, have not, you have a better odd of actually walking, just standing up and dying than you do winning a lottery. <laughs> Let's put that into perspective. Like that is the odds, bro. That. But think about how lucky you are to actually win the lottery, though. But think about it when you have two people that win the same numbers. What the like, fuck what is are the that chances? about? What what is that about? He just cut the uh, the odds in half. And then taxes in half. Oh. But if you look at the odds, <clears throat> a smaller country with its lottery has more chance of multiple people having the same numbers, right? Or not? Am I seeing it wrong? <clears throat> I think it depends on how many numbers there are, right? Because ours is 293 um, million different co- um, numbers. Possibilities. Yeah. What's, what's the thing here, Jordan? 40, 40 balls? Yes. No. More. Fifty or fifty? Forty balls. Oof. Is it? I, th- I thought it was forty. Or forty-two. Yeah, forty-two or something. Oh, uh, fifty-nine. Fifty-nine. Oh, fifty-nine. I need seven out of those. Huh? Yeah, but then the combinations. But it's happened here before, right? Like, like, oh, I won the lottery. Yo, huh. so it's three, four, or three or four other people. Well, there, there goes your million. Yep. <clears throat> One in 2,745 have a chance of dying by choking on your food. That's... Why do you got to say that? Now I'm not going to eat for the rest of the day. 
No. Every time I take a bite, I'm going to be like, am I going to choke on this now? Smoothies. Only smoothies. That's yes. how you solve that. <laughs> Wrong. One in 257,290 get killed by the straw they use to drink the smoothies. I would don't use the straw then. <laughs> I mean, stay away. We, well, the other or, or the glass spontaneously, spontaneously shattering and and do so a paper cup. Up, <laughs> paper cup. Yep. Worst they could do is dissolve, and then your hands are sticky. What do else? Do you, you play got? the lottery, Spade? I know Jordan and Matthew do. You don't. How Look at the that? odds. I just think to myself, I'm just not going to win. I'm not going to bother wasting my money. The odds, what the odds you don't matter. One? Yeah, but whether you, you'll you never win if you play zero dollars. Right? Right, okay, exactly. But, okay, but Spade, what are the odds that we would ever meet? Prior to four years ago, I would say zero. But then mm -hmm. things change, right? So it happens. So do the do the odds really matter actually if no, you they get don't. it once yeah it don't matter i mean because there are bother, people bro. who win it so yeah. you just have to be the one that wins and <laughs> the odds have nothing to do with it yeah i guess like the yeah, lottery here 100 it says of the targets you don't you don't what right true yeah yeah well, the, the saying in New York when you play the lotto is, uh, hey, you never know, right? So, Right. So, again, why don't you, even if it's a dollar? What would you do if you did only do it one time? That's usually how it works, right? The one fucking guy mm -hmm. that buys the ticket. There was that guy that won the $260 million and never even claimed the prize. Yeah. Why? He lost the ticket. I, I don't know. He, he lost the ticket or he didn't think he won. He threw it out. Bro. Didn't you say something last week about a guy? buying his first ticket in his in his life yeah. he's never bought a ticket before yeah. and he won That's a big last, prize yeah. the last powerball in florida never bought a ticket but beginner's one luck one. that was beginner's luck <laughs> yeah but would you if you go ask him do you think he would go well you have to look at the odds <laughs> too you know he's doing it um the the guy that bought the first ticket uh his first ticket he donated 50 percent of it to charity so he gets to keep the other 50%, no? Yeah, basically. It's just, I mean, it's nice. It's selfless. Yeah. Yeah, you have a one, you have a better chance of becoming president than you do win the lottery. <laughs> nice. <laughs> one in 32 million. Bro, that's just crazy. Wait, why 32 million? Are they assuming that 32 million people are qualified to become president? Probably. Yeah, we're not talking about the casino. We're talking about actual. And don't waste your money on scratch offs. Take it from me. Don't. Hmm. Yeah, don't. Go with the big prize. Mm, return on those. Again, there's luck. people. There's yeah. a guy that the guy in Jersey won the lottery. This is crazy wins the lottery. So you have an option on the back of the card. It tells you if you win, it's on the back of this, and you can mail it to this place. Okay, first off, I ain't mailing no fucking lie. I don't care if I have to fly to California to claim it. I'm not mailing shit. Even if you sign the back of it, I don't care. I'm not mailing it because you need that piece of paper to say that you won. So a guy in New Jersey, true story, wins $46 million dollars puts it inside of the post office box, tells everybody about it, and then he gets his check like three weeks later. Uh, I wouldn't... Uh, I'm not mailing anything. I don't care how it's delivered. I wouldn't even oh, trust one of my friends, this sounds shitty, to go deliver my ticket. I'll go with you. That's yeah, that's a, well, why would you not go? Unless it's a female. Oh, you got jokes. Oh, you got jokes. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, it's okay. true. Uh, money, money is a it corrupts everyone. I truly believe that. Yep. I really do. Corrupts or makes them vindictive. 
Oh, that's a difficult one. Ooh. I'd say makes them vindictive when uh, they remember all the people. Yeah. Well, that's not true because it, uh, in an inheritance, that's not vindictiveness. That's, different. that's people being greedy. That's different. No, yeah, but that, I, that's it, not it, the lottery. It brings the greed out of them. No, but it, it makes people greedy, right? How many people would come back crawling to you if they knew, ah, oh, Jay has 10 or 15 or $100 million that he just won? Hey, remember me? I was a hazer in 2012. Uh, I watched all your videos. I'm in, I'm in a financial pinch, man. Could you? I don't know. Bro, I don't even have that money, and I get those messages. <laughs> hey, man, I'm broke, you know. Uh, I could really use half of that wall right now to get myself off of cigarettes. <laughs> you need half? Yes, that would really help me greatly. Okay. Not the cheap shit. Could you like send me a mod or roughly around 2K? That will really help me out stopping smoking cigarettes. It, I feel like that will be the thing I need. One of those that sticks out is the Filipino. Hey, bald uncle, you give me you give me mods and RTA. <laughs> <laughs> so I got people now making fun of my weight loss. Why? What? I. It's crazy. I know. I, I, but we said this, right? No matter what, someone will find something. Yeah. So a guy responds to my short video and he says, uh, oh, God. So he goes, uh, talk, talking about keto. Keto is better than calorie counting because you're not limited to what you can eat. And I didn't respond. Then he responds to himself. Then he says, um, by the way, uh, first he says, I, your keto is the way to do it. I know, speaking from experience. Then his own comment to himself was, keto is better than calorie count because I can eat what I want. And then I'm saying to myself, no, you can't. No, no, you can't. You can't eat what you want because if you want to have mm -hmm. a fucking chicken, fried chicken cutlet sandwich, you can't have that on keto. And plus, that's a way of life. That's not a diet, right? You have to keep that up. Um and then I respond something, and then he's like, yeah. And, and then I said, well, then if your diet is better than mine, then let's do videos of weighing each other and see who's in better shape. Add me on my fitness pal. Let's see. Always, bro. Always somebody got to be negative. Always. Uh, it does not matter. Hmm, Do I don't understand that. I, it does not matter. I don't care what it's about, bro. Well, I could see it coming from th this. I don't approve of it, but I could understand the reasoning behind it. If I'm still overweight and now I see you succeeding and I failed multiple attempts of losing weight, I could see why people become vindictive and lash out. Not approving of it, I could see why. But if you already lost weight and you see another people losing weight, why do you even care? Why are you commenting? Good job. Go ahead. And move along. That's all you have You're to say. I say anything more or less. I Good think job. because Congrats. people wish it goes back to what Matthew was saying earlier. Envy. It's got to be envy, bro. It yeah. has to but be. He, yeah. But that doesn't work anymore because he already lost the weight. So why is he envious? You did it too. Did in a different he, way. Did he though? But then, maybe and it goes back to the first maybe, thing I said. But, but we don't know. Maybe he weighed 400 pounds and now weighs 320. Or That's 399. Well, wow. three ninety. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. it's also easier work. to lose eighty pounds at four hundred pounds at three twenty than it is at two fifty yeah. to one eighty. Let's be honest. Yeah. Uh, mm. Some someone that's eight hundred pound that loses a hundred pounds. That's a walk in a park, literally. Like that's you walking <laughs> into a park. <laughs> like get off your ass and walk to the park, bro. It's like people will complain about anything. Just, just I bet you just, if we sat here and we tried to think of one thing that you could say that nobody would complain about, you ain't gonna come up with anything. Think. Nope. Or this. Or oh. this. One thing. Death. Mm. Nope. Next. Here's a picture of a wall. People will complain about it. It's too blank. Yeah. It's yeah. that's yeah. it. You would no no, it that's would it. be you say it's blue. It's not blue. It's it's more like purple. <laughs> yes. an ugly wall. No, it's 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 a blue. <laughs> It's not purple. <laughs> right, but I'm just saying, like, that's what people yeah, would do, is they would... I know, I know. Like, <laughs> come up with an argument for this yeah. bottle cap. 
It should be thicker. You're, you're gonna... It's plastic. We it shouldn't should have glass. plastic bottle It should be a glass cap. bottle cap. A glass cap. Yes. Yeah, think okay. about the environment. You're selfish. You can't come up with anything, bro. You can't come up with anything that people will not complain about. There's no way. Nope. You can do it. The most possible. positive post ever, and there's bound to be that one dude that or one chick that. Uh, oh, but I got one. Donate money to a charity. What can you say? Why didn't you I have to do... donate to the charity? Yeah. There's a guy on I the corner. You donate it yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's a good one too. Yeah, when I was donating to war, war, wounded warriors, people were complaining that they take too much of the donation. So yeah, you're right. Someone's gonna find something. They're, they're going to take too much of the donation because they still need to pay the people who are doing everything. Not everybody works for free. That's what people don't understand. That's why a nonprofit still has employees. I think that the, if you would win the lottery on a scratch off or whatever, and you made a short, I think there's going to be a lot of needy people in the comments, but it wouldn't be negative. I don't think so because it's now they it want something from you. So I, no, no. Well, not initially. Not initially. They're going to be like, it's oh, kind of people. It, this motherfucker won the lottery. Why did this motherfucker win the lottery? They're going to say things like not that. Yet. No, not yet. Yeah, yeah, I, mean, I, don't think, I don't think right off the jump they're going to say that because they're going to want to try to get their feet in there to get some of that money. Yep. I don't it's think it would be negative off, right away. Positive. They and know yeah, right away they're not going to get money from you, Jay. If you win the lottery, you know for a fact that the people that hate you are not going to ask you for money. They're going to complain about yes, it. They will. They're going to say the, no. the worst person ever won the lottery. Ooh, They're going to say know about that. I don't know uh, about that. So. You I, underestimate the people. If I said to everybody money. on YouTube, look, we had a thousand comments. I'm giving away $10 million. Say something nice about me. A lot of those haters would be in those messages, right? But you're, but you're, but but now you're giving them an incentive. I'm not saying give them an incentive. You turned around and you made a video and saying, "Hey, look, I won the lotto. These are the numbers. Those are the, right. you know, look at right. the proof and everything like that." In that video alone, people will say negative comments. Oh, I don't know about because that. They will. They're gonna. They're gonna start. They're gonna start attacking you and saying about your like character. not jokingly. Oh, you're saying seriously, that... like seriously, yeah. or or just joking, trolling. No, no, no. You no, can't. You won't know if they're joking. Oh yeah, I would well, take it to like your your dumbass one. Like I would take that as a joke. Right, but if it's a person that you've normally seen with negative comments, and he wrote that, you know that's not a joke. If There's you know Bob like, Smith for the last oh, five years know. has written de negative comments on your on your know. page, and he all of a sudden uh, writes, "Congratulations," first, you should take that as I'm, sarcasm. I'm, 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 I'm willing to bet the first twenty four hours is going to be people asking for money and being very very friendly. And then when when that's Jay good. shoots down the first one, then it's what that's when the flood. Yeah, I agree. Are You're over. gonna get a lot of comments I could really use. I mean, just um, in the cash bank comments for $150, you got people giving stories. So I can still there's always I think there's gonna be that person that really envies or is jealous because you won and he didn't or she didn't. And it's gonna be like, Yeah, you're the last person to deserve this. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. You, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. They're gonna they're going to attack your character more so than anything else because it's like, why did this ask I bet you the attitudes would change off. I said I got a check for you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Best, I, that com I'll agree best with. comment. Best comment wins. Yeah, most friendliest <laughs> comment. Tell me something that I don't know about me. I, I still believe from the from the get-go, <laughs> people are gonna test the waters and gonna try to get some before they go negative. I would do that. I, like I win the lottery, I'm doing some stupid shit on my YouTube. I, I'm doing some stupid shit. The most friendliest comment. If we get the most comments and the most likes, I will do a randomizer and one person wins a million dollars. You would break. You would break YouTube. Yep. Yep. I don't even know how channel you run that be randomizer because you can only have 100,000 people in a randomizer. So I, channel would be banned. Oh, there's a cap on a randomizer? Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. You can only run such YouTube. a large query. 
YouTube's <laughs> gonna be like, no, this, this, this guy hacked something because it's not uh, this isn't possible. He has a million new subscribers and, and followers on, on YouTube overnight. That's not possible. Yeah, you blow. I blow up overnight, hundred percent. Overnight, overnight, done, done. But then you'd have to keep offering an incentive for I people. I got enough of money, right? There. It's okay. Yeah, you start off low. Yeah, fix that cash base. Mm -hmm. The social You could turn experience. around and say I you're giving have. out ten thousand dollars when this channel hits five thousand subs. You'll and see how fast that. you get five. That's you're, you're you're throwing out the idea. You didn't say how the people are going to get the ten thousand dollars. You could turn around and say a million dollars. It's not a contract, right? People aren't like I could turn around on any YouTube, start a YouTube channel tomorrow, call it whatever subtitles, right? So you could start it off and say, when we get to 10,000 subs, I'm going to give away a million dollars. When you get to 10 million to 10,000 subs, you just don't do it. You just got, you know what? I figured I'm going to double it or nothing. So 2 million when we get to 50,000. Tell me subscribers. you wouldn't like a spade. You've been to a casino, right? Right. Tell me you wouldn't like to have a million dollars and just put that like on a, on one bet. Just on black. I'm just black. throw it on black. Yes. Why not? <laughs> just see what happens. So, I would. That fun, bro. That fun. Oh my god. You're probably Give everybody gonna be in the restaurant you, right man. now a five star surf and turf. Everybody, right now. That's it. On the house. That's it. Everybody, right now. That's fine. That's it. Put it on the car. Yes. That's it. Yeah. <clears throat> I would love to be able to walk into a place and do that one day. Just once in my life. Just walk into a yep. a, a bar or a restaurant and be like, you know what? I'm paying for everybody's dinner. I'm paying and I'm gonna for buy the bar too. Drink. And I'm buying the bar too. I'm I'm buying everything. This is as uh, a matter yeah. of fact. I'm buying this whole block. Yeah. <laughs> see, you see, we can still have different opinions on what to do with the money. We're still friends. I would do the funhouse thing if I had that money. Ooh, yeah. With the, with the, <laughs> and I feel like with the right amount of lawyers. Yes. Oh, I like that idea. But I would I would do large scale social experiments on the population. If I, I got a better that idea. Kind of <laughs> OK, listen, how about this? If we hit a million subscribers on October 15th of 2024, I will give away one million dollars. But to who, though? You need to be more specific on that. Why do you need to be specific? You don't need because to be specific. Because it's a giveaway. It's mm -hmm. legal. Eight Dude, have we seen what is, they, is the rule? You, right everything, everything all varies on, on how you word everything. Yeah, but when you, you're no, 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 no. Trust me, bro, with cash paid, I've already went through lawyers. You have to be very specific. If I say I'm giving a million dollars, how, who, how to enter, when does it start, when does it end? Oh, so okay. you can be specific in the contract saying that it, by October, if we hit a million, I give away a million. But if you had 950,000, Mm. Then the contract's over, and that can be in the contract. So you didn't get it. That's part of the contract. So you ask for something that is not attainable. We need 10 million subs by October. That's obtainable. It, it, it's mm -hmm. 10 million subs? Absolutely. Yeah. How? Bro, if you were giving a million dollars away on YouTube, I guarantee you your sub count went from fucking five to 20 million. Yeah, there's gonna be a call center in Bangladesh making new yes, accounts. Like YouTube this. would flag your account 100. percent Even though you go by policy, something is wrong. Like some something something ain't right. Absolutely, you could do it. Absolutely. And then the good thing is, is that's an investment because now all those videos are monetized. Hmm. Now you're like Mr. Beast, just making bank off of silly shit. Yeah. Yeah, he still spends a million dollars on an on an episode or a video. But this is is it his money or is it investors' money? Yeah, now he got sponsored, right? Amazon or some shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow, that's nice. Uh, listen, there's only so much money you can make off of YouTube, right? Until you need to make money from somewhere else. 
And I also think there's a window at one step. With, I, I mean, there's a peak and then you can, and then it stabilizes right. out. And then the flat lines, the flat lines. It. Yeah. You have to ride it out as, as long as you can. And then Mr. Beast and, will eventually. And that's speed. why, and that's why he pushes the limits. He pushes the limits because yep. he has to keep, he's creating that limit, huh? What's the biggest channel on YouTube, Jay? How many subs does that have? T T P K India, the uh, the Indian um, uh, YouTube channel, the one I was competing with PewDiePie. And it's T like what, fifty million or more? No, it's it's more. Um, it's it's high. Uh, T series, it's uh, two hundred and sixty-two million. <laughs> yeah, it's even got Mr. Beast beat. Like that's. T series don't mess around. That's and, an and what Indian, kind of channel is this? It's like mu Indian music channel. <laughs> like, like I'm I don't know how I don't know how I, don't know how it goes. I, I, I can't do the the Indian accent, but um, Bollywood, you know, uh, something like that. <laughs> Bollywood, nice. Well, we oh, just I, lost I, the Indian market. No, that's okay. <laughs> we'll we'll get over it. <laughs> wow, two hundred and fifty million. That's insane. Two series T series is two hundred and sixty-two. Mr. Beast has two hundred and sixty two forty six. So he's twenty million shot. Oh, so he's huh. almost there. Yeah, and PewDiePie was number one, remember? And then T Series and him were going at it head to head and Yeah. Now PewDiePie's a lost soul because they got Mr. Beast. It's money, bro. Money, 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 money. Mm -hmm. money, money, money. You can only be on top for so long before no. you get knocked down and you have to work your way back up again. I don't know about that. What do you mean? Well, then somebody else takes over or does something that's a little bit different yeah. and gets more popular than you do. I don't know, I don't know about that. How are you going to beat T-Series, bro, if they're gaining like a million people a day? How are you going to beat that? That's like saying you could come out with a YouTube. That's YouTube is huge. Alphabet company. You ain't going to create a company that's bigger than YouTube. It ain't going to happen. It's just not going to happen. If you're on top, you can't. Apple, how do you? Well, how? Even well, stock it crashes. Has happened. It has happened before. What, depression? That's what you're talking about? Stock market crash? No, I'm it saying a lot that of companies, things. if they stand still, they get smashed. Right. Nokia no innovation. Is the best example. Fine. And Name one. one was having Nokia. Name Nokia. one. Nokia. Nokia is the biggest one. Nokia was at the top of the world. Motorola, top of the world. Motorola created the first cell phone. Yeah. Look okay, where they are now. Apple came out and made a fucking smartphone. Yeah. Give me a company that does not exist anymore. Well, Nokia still exists. Oh, it right, can't so exist anymore. Yeah. Okay, complete. Well, well nobody remembers. Yeah, like they're done. Like they're over. Yeah. But if you're yeah, using well, the Armist thing on the top, that's a little bit different. That's the mm -hmm. tech field. <clears throat> but if you look at the top now, you'll never beat Apple. Never. I don't give a shit. Yeah. You can combine all of them. Um, no, but Nokia is mean, over. But you, you agree, Jay? Uh, Nokia's Nokia, not over. You the example? Right Nokia. Yeah, yeah, but that's, that's the, not the, Nokia what used to be Nokia. That's, uh, and Nokia uh, has sold company. most of Nokia. A yeah, company that details. bought the name. They they bought yeah. the name. That's not right, Nokia. But it's still anymore. Nokia. Yeah, it's details. And that, well, that, well, no, regardless. Still, no, think about on the top. When you're on the top top, okay? Like right now, name somebody that could take over Apple or Facebook. Nobody, bro. You, you can't knock those down. Even the government couldn't touch those. Trump tried. If you're on the top, man... Now, not ten years ago. Okay, I'll give you the ten year ago. I uh, went Nokia, fine, but now, no way. You can't and, compete and with YouTube. Each time, each time there's a contender or somebody that threatens to be more and more popular. Right. What do they do? Tell me, well, what's this thing cost over here? Yeah, how much? In our service. Yeah, how much? how much? How yeah. much? It's yeah, just like Twitter. You know, Twitter. Was kicking its ass because they bought Vine, right? Bought mm -hmm. Vine the same time yeah. TikTok came out. You know that Twitter and they shut it down. Was like, what the fuck? 
bro. You had Logan Paul. You had all your PewDiePie. All your big people. You should have reopened those servers. Yeah. You didn't. You just let it go. Just like Periscope. You let it go. Now you have everybody streaming live. You have opportunities and you're just focusing on text types. Well, look at what look at what happened with Elon Musk. He went and spent how many billions of dollars to buy TikTok, and now it's a former version of itself. Nobody's on TikTok anymore. Oh, like huh? the the amount of users that were active on you on TikTok. I mean, sorry, on Twitter. Twitter. On Twitter. Oh, I mean, Twitter. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Twitter, right? He he. The, there's if they had a million people a day uh, active, now they got half or less than that. So it's yeah, it's it's crazy asking, how you you can you can ruin it like this different different things and yeah who's to say that Tim Cook doesn't turn around one day and does something different and he thinks that it's a great idea but it doesn't work out and now Apple is hemorrhaging money I mean it's going to take a, a lot of mistakes to do that but it could still happen and you bump look at MySpace years ago MySpace was the number one thing. Facebook wasn't even a, a blimp on that radar. Yeah, but right? Facebook isn't why MySpace is gone. It has nothing to do with it. No, I'm not. Yeah, I, yeah, I agree with that. But at that point, MySpace turned around yeah. and says, oh, right. we have to change a little bit so that way we can, you know, right. nobody can get to our level. Right. But the changes they made ruined the company. It's like, and who Facebook makes these executive up. decisions? Like, are these millionaires that buy these companies? I hate yes. to say this. Are they fucking stupid? Like, because they're out of reality. We're common they're out people, of right? We're common folk. Us on here. Right. We're common. Right? Some are a little bit better than us, but we're common folk. And we say relaunch by now, right? You still got the same users. Incentivize mm -hmm. the people that were there. Logan Paul, hey, listen, we'll pay you a million dollars. Just upload there instead of TikTok. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Like, what the fuck are we doing? I don't know. I who Look is in Spotify charge did. of your marketing? Like what right. Right. Look at what Spotify did. Their numbers on podcasts jumped up because they spent how much money on Joe Rogan? Right. I, I, and their numbers, their why numbers does it, shot up. Why doesn't Apple launch its own fucking social media? I don't know what they're doing. You because have all this money. Like, that field. They don't want to jump into that field. Maybe it's more of a headache to them or they don't understand the field that much. Why? Look at Google. Google spent how much money on that stupid social media thing that they did and how much money did they lose and they canceled it. What what social media? Yeah. Um what, what what the hell was it called? Google had a um, Google uh, Hangouts? Google no. Hang no no not Google. Hangouts. It's a social media that that Google, Google One uh, created. Google One Plus? No, Google, Google. Google Plus? No, Google no, no, Meet? No. Was it? No, because Google no, Plus is the one that was like Facebook, where you could post and then people would respond. And then. Uh, yeah, Google Places? Plus. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, Google, Google Plus. Plus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, they spent how much money on that and they failed miserably. They, they, were, they jumped in the market too, too late. You, you're, you're, you're right next to Facebook. You got to slow down, booster seat. But I, I'm just telling you, the Vine and TikTok thing is such a dead giveaway. You still own it. Like, drop it. What are you doing? I, well, maybe talk, could it be that there, there were uh, that they can't because they made agreements or something not to do it. But, but you own it, right? Vine. Like you you own Vine, you own it, and then you made a Vine too. Just make a, a new Vine. Not even take the same servers, bro. They haven't changed that much, hmm. unless you deleted all that shit. Well, then that's that's I another, doubt it. That's a well, they have to buy law Somebody, for what, eight years for legal reasons? Seven, eight years, I think it is. Well, look at TikTok. TikTok's going to get banned in the U.S., right? No fucking way. Never. Well, they have to sell. They have to because they have to sell to a U.S. market. That's what the, that's what it's uh, that's what it is now. TikTok needs to sell themselves to a U.S. market in order to operate in the U.S. That was what the Supreme Wait, Court what? said. Oh, this is new? Yeah, this happened like a week or two ago. TikTok needs to, in order for it to stay in the U.S. market, because the U.S. is saying that, oh, all our information is getting siphoned into China or because China right, right, is the right. primary, right. primary owner, TikTok needs to have American investors. So they need to sell themselves to an American company or find American investors. I have not heard this. Own TikTok. Yeah. I have not heard this. Hmm. So... Yeah. 
And I'm sure the government's going to be can... smart about it, not just, you know, let some Chinese dude buy it in America. It has to right. be. So are they able to keep their name or I have not yeah, heard they would yeah, they would be able to keep everything the same. They just but have to have different stuff owners. has to be on American servers. Not on American servers. The company has to be owned by, by not by China. That not by Chinese. Really um, Changes people. a lot. What? The information is I still did in not China. Hear this. What does it yeah. matter then? So they they have they have uh, what was it? I think, oh, three days ago. Uh, yeah, I, I want to say I want to say they have like ninety days when that thing goes into effect. They have ninety or one eighty days in order to sell themselves. It does matter. Also, Jordan, can't be in the, the US states get, get the states gets uh, revenue out of it, right? Yeah, that's right. Because they're not yeah, going to make any money off of it. Oh shit! Like yo. Yeah, but when you look at the the house, it wasn't even the Supreme Court, it was the house, how much people oh, the house. supported that. Like even Biden. They're everyone. They're everyone. literally yeah. what the fuck All are the, they gonna do? Hmm. Well, listen, who's to say that they're not going to find Chinese investors in the US? We're American, but they still own it. You don't know what's going to happen. If this actually falls through, all it is, I guarantee you, all it is is going to do is change. It's going to look like it changed hands, but it's still the same hand underneath controlling everything. I guarantee that. Okay. Okay. What happens if I just change names and release it under a different name? Still does the same thing. It's still a the same thing. A sale though. of TikTok within 180 days, as House pass legislation requires, would be one of the thorniest and most complicated transactions in corporate history posing financial, technical, and geopolitical challenges that experts said could render a sale impractical and increase the likelihood of the app will be banned from all phones, Android and iOS. In the U.S. specifically, so not then, anywhere else. Oh, my. Well, now would be the time for Vine to come back out. Like, yep. now, now is the time. Uh, Elon Musk has to be looking at this. He, come on. Well, he's not CEO. He's just the owner. He has somebody else being playing CEO. It doesn't he's matter, bro. Now. Like, it doesn't matter. A... Somebody there has got to tell somebody. <laughs> Yo, you guys got to do this. This so we is can get it. Some of the like, this shit. is the moment. But at the same time, at the same time, though, you still got YouTube short and Instagram reels and Facebook reels. So those could shoot up. I yeah, don't see big, any of those big it. companies buying TikTok, though. I don't see it because they have their platform. Right. They'll probably do it and dissolve it and right. buy it. That's probably, oh, mark this down, March 24th. I'd be willing to bet that either YouTube or, or Meta buy it, dissolve it, and then say post on Facebook we've incorporated or a new app name or something. It's yeah. it's not going to be TikTok. Well, think about this. Meta turns around and says, um, Instagram Reels and Facebook Reels are now leaving our platform and going on to our new platform called TikTok, a meta company. It's not Monopoly because YouTube still has shorts. So there's still competition. How much is TikTok selling for? I don't think they. I don't oh. think they have a price yet, but it would be hundreds of a hundred billion dollars. Yeah. Okay. One. Oh wow. Yeah. Okay. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Get the, no buy company that? is buying that. No way. Even, even, even Apple with all its money, if they buy that, I mean, they still got trillions. So. <laughs> so the only companies that could buy it are Apple, Meta, Alphabet, and Microsoft. Those are the so only the companies three. that have the liquid asset to buy that. There you go. So and Meta, I, Apple, Tube, and Apple's not going to buy it, man. There's no reason for Apple to get into social media. Mm -hmm. They're a tech space. Stay in tech space. You're the first one to say, yeah, if, you, if you make something good, stick with that. Don't, don't branch out into other things, right? You've told me this how many times? So why would Apple say, you know what, guys? Let's go spend $100 billion and create our own social network. They're not going to do it. It doesn't gain developed. anything for them. It's already developed. You already have the users. 
Yeah, so I don't think it matters. You a company buying it and dismantling it would not be a good thing because then no. you're the, the moment you dismantle it, you're gonna have people scatter to the the the, the other ones, your competition. Yep. No, no, no. Because you don't you don't you don't you don't do that right away. You wait a year or two or you rebrand it or you do something else. You're not shutting it down. You're just going to put your name on top of it. Look at when Facebook bought WhatsApp. The guy right? from Blizzard wants to buy TikTok. The CEO. The guy from Blizzard, the from Activision, he used to be yeah. the guy from Activision. Bobby Kotick. He's not where is he gonna find the money for that? He can't afford that. Right. He would have to find a million people to 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 get the the money that he needs. There's no way. Wait, aren't they aren't they owned by Microsoft now? No, Activision is. No, it's Activision. Yeah, oh, you're right. But he doesn't yeah, work yeah, at Blizzard anymore. He doesn't. But he doesn't work at Blizzard anymore. Yeah, he's former. Yeah, he was uh, the former CEO. He doesn't work there anymore, so that's not. He doesn't have good relationships anymore, or else he would have been still CEO. Yeah, probably. <laughs> so <laughs> Microsoft's going to come out of nowhere and say, you know what? you got a good idea. Let me go buy TikTok. It's not going to happen, guys. Not from these small people. It's going to be it's if it's going to be Apple small people, it's going to be a collective media app called Ping. I've never heard of Ping. Neither have I. Apple culture doesn't seem like it's a natural fit for TikTok. Social media is a messy, unwieldy business that requires constant monitoring to weed out hate speech and offensive images. Apple doesn't have the infrastructure for that kind of operation. It's one go at the social media scene. The buggy and short-lived app called Ping was one of Apple's biggest flops. I have never heard of that. I guess that's why it was a flop. Maybe he didn't get out of the beta testing stage even. Oh, I, it was. It used to be called iTunes Ping or simply Ping. It was a software-based, music-oriented social network and recommended recommender system developed and operated by Apple Inc. I have never heard of that. Nope. The I'm service happy. launched with 1 million members in 23 countries. The service allowed users to follow artists and see short, timely postings yeah, by both friends and artists. As much as the United States government is is denying TikTok for future evaluation in 180 days, the problem is whether China would allow ByteDance to export its algorithm, the secret sauce that keeps TikTok users glued to their phones. Hmm. So mm -hmm. even if they sold it, would they release their algorithm like on their app? Hmm. Who's going to buy it without the algorithm? That's your bread and butter. That's like saying is, is Apple's that, going to sell they're, they're going to sell hundred billion dollars, bro. A hundred billion dollars ain't nobody gonna fucking buy that. I'm telling you right now, that is entirely too much money. That's that's ludicrous. Isn't the algorithm part of the platform? Not necessarily, because yeah. they could hold nah, intellectual rights right, on, the, yeah. on the software. No, the coding isn't. Uh, no. It yeah. depends on how you don't have now. to you could sell every look at Nokia, right? Nokia sold their maps and everything to Garmin. They they became such a small company now because they sold their parts. You can pick and choose what you want to sell. You can pick and choose mm -hmm. everything. I want to sell well, for if, if Jay said Jay said I want to sell Vape Life, right? Somebody could just buy the name. Somebody else could buy the store. Somebody else can buy the juice line. You understand? He doesn't yeah, have to sell not one big price. Package. Like George said, not at that price. You're not gonna. Oh, not I'm just price. gonna yeah, buy one every day. See, if if I'm going to a store and it's for sale and it's fully furnished and the juice is in there and you're asking for a hundred million, I'm gonna assume that everything is included. <laughs> for Europe, is the same thing. Europe wants to ban TikTok as well. All of Europe. Well, I think thing. it's a good thing. See? Ban it all. They passed the law 24 hours ago. European Union. Oh, you're in trouble, bro. Yo, you got half the world. There's going to be something that takes its place. It's as simple as that. People Fine. are used to it, so they're they going need to, look to for bring. Else. Yo, I'm gonna I'm gonna tag old Elon here because uh, you, you <laughs> seriously need bring to bring back Pine. You, you got to stop playing hey. around, man. Hey, Elon. Well, okay, maybe add ask a little. You, why? 
why so adamant on Vine when there's so many other platforms that are still out today that they can't just go to that? Nothing is why like Vine? TikTok. Nothing is like TikTok. But you still have shorts and you still have reels. Not Those like are TikTok. very similar. But Works that's all the that TikTok, TikTok is. But that's all that TikTok is, is shorts. YouTube, you can find full videos, short videos. It's not focused. It's like my YouTube channel. It's vapes and e-bikes. It's not focused. If you focus... Let, let Meta buy TikTok and just make that app called, instead of TikTok, it'll be just, or TikTok Reels, done. That's it. Oh, I would get rid of the name. Now it has negative connotations. Eventually. Yeah. You don't have to do everything one, two, three. No company has ever bought another company and shut down everything right away, at least not to my knowledge. Right. So they're going to take a year. They're going to say, oh, we're calling it, you know, we bought TikTok. We're going to call it TikTok Reels. And then eventually they're going to start removing things from the previous name. And they're just going to be like, oh, it's now called Reels. We reinvented and we rebranded. And that's that. Twitter was rebranded to X. And that didn't take right. Exactly. Long. That's a stupid idea. People aren't going on X because it's because it's not called TikTok. I mean, uh, Twitter anymore. It's called X. The stupidest reasons. People aren't going on to X because of Elon Musk. That's why Elon gave away his uh, his seat at the top and became uh, just a board member instead of the CEO. And he put somebody else in charge. It's a privately held company. He could do that all he wants. You know, from the from the behind the scenes, he's controlling everything. Well. It's a big thing, and it's a it's a lot of money. Hundred billion. So apparently, Europe fined uh, TikTok six hundred three hundred seventy two million dollars <coughs> two months ago, and now they're suing them again for eight hundred million. European Union huh. for uh, letting minors access TikTok. It's going to come to the point where you're going to have to be at least eighteen years that's old crazy. to be on social media. That's crazy that they're trying to get rid of TikTok. Like that's. Trump was trying to do it. I can't believe that's going to go through. Like, good for the it's all American because companies. of an algorithm. That's what this is all about. It's no, the algorithm that they be want. Banning DJI drones next. I mean, we're just trying to rule out China as a whole. Shit. Yep. Uh oh. Uh, don't you have to be eighteen to be on you to have a YouTube uh, YouTube account or sixteen to have a YouTube account as well? Thirteen, I no, believe. No. Thirteen. No. Look at Ryan's toys reviews. That kid was doing reviews at five. So no. Oh. Yeah. So there you go. You don't need you don't there's no age. But then again, that's um, an American company, right? That's gonna play favorites. It's like the Skydio thing, where mm. uh the government instead asking DJI to make their military drone that they've been doing, they said, uh, oh, we have an American company, Skydio. Let's make a contract for them and then let's ban that's DJI it. drones. And that's what they did. So America is favoring YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, you know. And that makes sense. It does. It does because it wants you to, to you know, it wants something to stick to the U.S. The dude that owns, the dude that owns, you, you, did you hear about this? This is going to sound a little racist, but I don't give a shit. Did you know <laughs> what language do Singaporeans speak? English. Mm -mm. They speak Mandarin Chinese. <laughs> okay. Right? So did you know that there's this whole thing going on that Singaporeans are just fancy dressed Chinamen? <laughs> <laughs> and obviously well, people from Singapore don't like it very much, but that's essentially what it is. It's just the... <laughs> it's fancy just, dressed... Chinaman. That's it. That's what singer. I didn't know that the owner of TikTok was Singaporean, but then again, it makes sense because yeah. he's just a fancy dressed Chinaman. Um, that's nice. <laughs> they kept asking him that on the when 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 yeah. the house was asking I questions. The, he was asking him. He kept saying, "Are you are you part of China?" He goes, "No, I'm Singaporean." Do you speak Chinese? He goes, "No, I don't speak Chinese. I speak whatever." And they kept asking him that, like trying to make him sound like he's in cahoots with China or some shit. 
He's obviously in cahoots with China because fucking TikTok is huge in China. It's just the education mm. virgin. They're just obviously you are. Right. They're, yeah, you're. I can't believe that they waved in favor of you. Got to sell, bro. Like you're either gonna have to lowball yourself or leave. I don't think they're gonna leave. There's no way. And you don't think the government's I mean, gonna probably be gonna watching who it. you sell to? You don't think the government's gonna scrutinize the, the the seller or, or the purchaser? I think it has to be approved. I think it has to be approved by the of US. Course. Of course. So, so so what's the the annual revenue of TikTok? Is that somewhere available or probably not because it's Chinese. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who's to say they even make a profit? You don't know. Oh, they make oh wow. Uh, they did release it uh, in uh, just uh, 2023. They made 14.3 billion dollars. Hmm. Yeah, 14 billion. Lot. Yeah, but they're asking for a hundred. <laughs> yeah, because that's what it's worth. Well, it, but they made nine so billion, total. and they made nine billion in 2022. 14. Point 14.3 in 2023 and projected is they're at 15 billion now for 2024. So yeah, they're going to make it. It's, it's going to be only uh, going to go up. Yeah. It's unless a couple of uh, countries ban you, then it's going to go down real quick. Mm -hmm. I think that they, would, the they, they should dissolve it. If, if a company like Google buys it and dissolves it and they see that their numbers are going up, um, it, it would be in their best interest to dissolve it. Biden dissolve it. Because now their Even numbers are going to fall. Yeah, well, there's well, no way they're going to go through all numbers? of those TikTok accounts, bro. There ain't no way that they're going to go through them and siphon through all the miners and go through that data log. No fucking way. Uh-uh. I don't know how many users are on TikTok, but there ain't no way someone's doing that. That's, that's way too much. You have to... Uh, Higher, I don't know how many people to do that shit. They have 1.7 billion users, bro. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody got time for that. No. Ain't nobody gonna go through that. Hmm. Even one person could do maybe 10 accounts a day to no feed through. And, and you can't do everything. a bot. Can't do a bot. You're gonna, you're gonna need to have Ban a people who person. Because so remember, you have to go be... through every single video. Just because a kid is in a video, what if you get banned because you have your kid in your video? You can't do that. So you would need but to have somebody. But it's not everything. the videos, right? It's the account that, that, that matters because they're. You still have to watch the videos to see what the deal is. But, but the, 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 the kid in the video doesn't matter. It's the account. Kids yeah. have accounts on TikTok. That's what matters. So the only thing you That's can do about it is block everybody's account. And now you have to prove, officially prove the official documents that you're 18, you're not a kid. That's going to backfire and no one's going to do it. And why do you have get to, off let's of talk about this. Why do you got to be 18 years old on, on TikTok? Like, why? Genuine question. Why? I feel like it's the same reason why video games, they put the, the, the like, when it becomes too hyper-violent or too much or anything like that. I think TikTok has, for what people are thinking, it has brainwashed the youth and they're doing stupid things all the time. You don't like agree with, with that? Like with the challenges and everything. The challenges came from TikTok. All those stupid challenges are all from TikTok that get that got brought over to shorts and reels and everything in between. So you agree with so it or you I, don't agree with it? I agree with it. So you're saying that minors should not be on TikTok? I I personally believe minors should not be on social media to begin with. I'm not saying just TikTok. I'm Any just saying social, social media. media. I social media should be 18 and up, or at least 16 and up. Let's just you know go a little bit you know, or something that's strictly strictly regulated. Yeah. But then again, you can't have adults and the kids on the same platform to do that. Just like when you were a kid and you had AOL, right? When you had an account that was 13 years old, you can't go into the adult chats. You couldn't go into other things. Right. You were spe specific to your certain things that you could go to. If Elon Musk relaunches Vine just based off this, all those people that are on TikTok would move over to Vine.
Right. And then their value goes right. down. You say that, but somebody who has a million subscribers on, on TikTok is going to go to Vine to start back at one? No, they're going to take the Not subscribers that. with it. But I, I do agree with what you said, Spade, to a certain extent. But don't you think if you're looking back at your youth, if you make it illegal, you make it more enticing for your youth or you make it impossible, they'll find a way. There's always a way. Yeah, but that's going to be like one in every 10 kids. They're going to have. Yeah, but it's the same with smoking. There's an age on smoking. There's an age on drinking. They will find a way to get the cigarettes and get the drinks. There's always. I'm not a way. saying that they're There's not. Always a way. I'm not saying. I'm not saying that they're not. They will. But you know what? There should be some sort of regulation then, to that. Like everyone says, 13 years old. Why is a 13 year old on social media? Again, Why? we need interference from a governing body because. A lot of people can't be left to their own devices to make the right decisions. I agree with that. People are not going to agree with that mm -hmm. statement, but I 100% agree that the government needs to get involved. And they have. They're supposed to that's protect why the people, right? That's that's the yeah. idea of True. the government. Like that, now they're doing their actual job. So before people worry about all oh, the government should be stepping foot, their their idea is for the people by the people. So that's right. exactly what they're doing. Well, Look at TikTok. The TikTok that we have here and the TikTok that I have in China is totally different. The TikTok in China, if I'm not mistaken, is mostly educational, educational. as opposed to the stu mm -hmm. Right? It's so? Yes. It's filtered. So it's filtered. Why can't we do the same thing so, here? Okay, yeah, I guess the next question is, is, if it's filtered in China, why is it not filtered here? Because so we're stupid. Well, communism, like, so you're saying communism is good. <laughs> I didn't say that. No, I'm Not just saying I, that's uh, that. I, I don't know. It seems to be working over there. Well, if 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 they see the U.S. as an enemy, wouldn't your enemy? Wouldn't you want to make your enemy stupider over time than smarter? Exactly. And make your own you. population smarter. Nailed and it. if the government gets involved, you're, you're likely going to get the freedom of speech stuff, right? Because uh, I want to be on that platform. I want to say what I can, so what I have to say, and. The government, but you government can't though. It, uh, the government, although again, it only, how many times, it's like, it, how many times are you going to say counts, that? It only counts for the government, not like Jay said. Not, freedom exactly. of speech is not for your neighbor. It's right, right. against the government. Right, 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 right. That's why people are like, oh, I can't say anything on Facebook. No, you can't because they have their it's own It's a private rules. company, bro. Private it's, company. They, yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's public in a sense that it's traded, but it's private. They make their own fucking policy, man. They don't like you. Well, don't you, like you, you can say whatever you want. Yeah. Sure, you yeah. Can say you whatever can, you want. You would say, But you're yes. going to get banned. Right. <laughs> That's the repercussions you, of that. You can say you it wear once. shoes. That's yeah, exactly. You wear shoes in your house, right? But if I go to Jay's house, I can't wear my shoes. No, it's my freedom to wear shoes wherever I want. Not in Jay's house because Jay owns that house. So if he says no shoes, then it's no shoes. It's fairly simple, and people right. don't understand that. And once again, you, you can, can probably do it once with all the <laughs> repercussions that come after that. I can't believe I haven't heard about this. Did you guys know, Jordan or Matthew, about the TikTok? No. No. Oh. no. I most of the news was covering that uh, Russia thing, right? In Moscow. That's yeah. the only thing that's been in the news for a couple of days. Well, if that dies down and the TikTok thing will, will surface. <laughs> that actually. And then you're going to have well, people fighting for TikTok. Don't ban TikTok in the US. Wait, wait fighting like physically showing some the laziest people ever protesting. just want to make protesting. <laughs> a pro really well they might so. make hold on they might make a TikTok about saving TikTok. Mm. so a TikTok challenge to <laughs> save TikTok. that's what you're saying okay yeah if you if you sign into TikTok now i think it says that uh you know uh call it says something like call your uh your your Local your elected representative. Not, really? Yeah, your representative. Yeah, I think it believe I believe it says that. I need to see this. <laughs> it's so the TikTok owner um, 
said that it will damage millions of businesses and destroy the livelihoods of content creators. I believe no, it won't. won't. No, it won't. Because they'll just go to Why a not? new fucking platform. <laughs> Other platform. Again, but they're building something new again. That's the okay. problem. Okay, and where do you think those people that were watching you on TikTok are going to go? You don't have a choice. They're going to go to the other platform. To the next platform. Yeah, it's not like they have to stay on there. There's nothing to stay on. You got to go. What the fuck? Just like the people that were on Vine. Did Vine disappeared? They all went to YouTube and got super famous. Logan yeah. Paul, Jake Paul, PewDiePie. They got more famous than Vine. Right, so let and the and fucking and move. Let it, let, it, let it dissipate. That's fine. Who gives a shit? Everybody. Yeah, Spade, why do you think, let's say you're on TikTok, you have 5,000 followers and you go to another platform. If they five, those 5,000 followers really like you, why, why do you think you have to start from zero again? You just go, oh, this platform is moving to that platform. That's it. Resubscribe over there. Thank you. Okay. If that's the case, how come 200,000 subscribers of Jay did not go to Twitch? I don't really promote Twitch very much. But he still says that, you know, he's... If I deleted streaming. my YouTube, the, the better question yes. was if I deleted my YouTube, would my Twitch count go up? Yes. Right, exactly. I I, I don't know. I think, I think I feel it's fantastic. Like, I feel like Jay is more active on Twitch than he is on YouTube. Yeah, well, people, ever since, don't, actually, don't wait, like let me rephrase. Me, yeah, like, ever since the dual streaming, <laughs> ever since the dual streaming, no. But before the dual streaming, yes, I feel like he was more active on Twitch than he was on YouTube. Sure, he was adding videos every so often, but he would spend more time on Twitch than he did on YouTube. So how come he didn't get his 200 subs there? Yeah, but, but what Mixter said, you're, you're always going to lose subs. Th those are the subs that are subbed and never, uh, never right, watch you. they don't you. even do anything. Yeah, I got 212,000, but I got 5,000 active people. So. Yeah. Uh, yeah. it's, it's the same thing with Mr. Beast. Look at his video. He's got 240 million. You don't even get 240 million views. Like, there's uh, people. Well, you're just... never going to get the full, yeah. No. Yeah, yeah. And the thing is with Ninja, Ninja made out great when he moved over to that gaming thing and then they closed. You just got a $17 million paycheck for nothing. That's nice. Hmm. That's fantastic. That gaming, I can't remember the name of the gaming platform. Wasn't that You're part of Mixer. Microsoft? Didn't Microsoft Mixer? own that? I think it was Mixer or something. Or um, Yeah, wasn't that Microsoft owning that? I think so, yeah. And then they realized that they weren't making any, any money. Yeah. yeah. I think it's fantastic that TikTok's going to be shut down. It's like my Discord. Let's close it up. The difference is, is one is active, uh, the other one isn't. <laughs> point in case we have you give people the opportunity and they're in there, but they're not in there. That's <laughs> yeah, it's uh, I don't know, I don't think it's uh, gonna change much, not for me at least. I don't visit that you don't platform use TikTok, at all, do you? Nope, I'm good. Uh, I I think from what I've heard from you guys, I think the world is a better place for not I having spades it. on it. <laughs> I had a TikTok. I never used it. I never posted anything, and I I only have it for the final credits. That's it, and I don't even really use it. The other guys upload over there. But it, it just kind of depends on what you're looking for. I have no bathtub babes yeah, on my TikTok feed. I agree, but how many platforms is enough? I mean, I got saying. Twitch, I got YouTube, and I barely use Facebook. Okay, and I have Instagram probably as well. But the best one, it. the best one for video uploading is YouTube. I mean, it's it's quite yeah. literally that simple. They have the best codecs, best compression, best server space. I, it's Google, it's Alphabet. You know, that's uh, that's the best one. But that's because. YouTube was conceived and is meant as a video upload, a video watching uh, platform, right? Facebook is mm -hmm. actually friends getting into contact with other friends and sharing their pictures. And it, it was never meant as a, as a as as to be the same thing as YouTube with the videos. 
and the same thing with Instagram. Too, Instagram was supposed to be just pictures. Yeah, they're trying to mm -hmm. compete and stay in the now. Um, and then you had Threads. That was their attempt, failed attempt at going after Twitter. Um, which is there's still there's still a lot of people on Threads. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of subs over there, and I ain't posting shit. I don't know where those subs are coming from. Um, because you already have I, an Instagram account. It's easier to, to jump on Threads because you have an Instagram yeah, account. Yeah, but I don't post anything. I posted one thing on Threads. Hey, here's my penis. <laughs> just in case, just in case you do, just in case you do. Are, are there nice comments or nasty comments? After I, I don't even think I have the Threads app. The only way I can get into Threads is going through Instagram. Yeah, I don't even. Oh, have the app. I, I I checked it out. It doesn't say anything. If I wanted to make a new account or anything, it doesn't say anything. For what? TikTok doesn't say a warning or contact anything. But that's because that's because you're in Belgium it has nothing to do with uh, like in the US. Like now I feel like I have to. Yeah, but they're they're planning to ban it here as well. So you would think. With 2400 followers, I, I don't even post. <laughs> I, <laughs> I said last picture in your camera roll. That's what it is. Okay. <laughs> I, They're just patiently waiting until you become active. <laughs> yeah, Facebook is trying to, like, they pay the best, too, for views. A uh, thousand views, you get, like, 11 bucks. That's pretty damn good. Like, that's, it beats YouTube, but you can't compete. Oh, yeah, where you switch. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The same thing with WhatsApp. Remember, WhatsApp was his own thing, and then Meta bought him out? Mm-hmm. It'll be something else if Apple buys TikTok. Huh. I talk. I am not a fan of TikTok, but I will be if Apple buys it. And the second they mm. ban me, I'm going to say I'm never going to buy an Apple product. Look at my account. Make a, make a decision. Make a decision. Yes. Mm. All right. How was the stream? Good? Good. 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 Yes. Great. good. Sex talk. Poop talk. It was good. <laughs> okay. Uh, see you guys next week. Same time, same yeah. rhyme. We're going to have eventually have to go over the... Uh, Women are better than men thing, because uh, I feel like that's edgy. Um, okay. Oh, yeah. On this platform or? Yeah. <laughs> TikTok. We're going to go to TikTok. 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 Yeah, we're going to do a last two raw. <laughs>